Ninja Kiwi, can you add Toilet Tower Defense to here as it's quite W? Ugh, fine. I've prepared 14 TTD adventures for you to go on. Wait, what, really? Yes, now shut up as I'm eating my prongles. Bro, what is a literal cat doing in here? Wait, kitty, where'd you go? Guys, there's a cat toilet that's ten times faster than the pink balloon. Bro, and how is that possible? I should be able to pop it since I can pop around 900 DDTs. I've never seen you do that, but okay, let's try it. A few inches later. Okay, now you gotta immediately snipe it when you see it. Bro, what I didn't even see it. Yo, Permaspike, can you put like a bajillion spikes at the end of this weirdly white map? Yeah, dude, that's quite literally my job. A few moments later. <laughs> Bro, is this cat toilet invincible or something? Yo, Sai, you're the greatest thinker in the world, so can you tell me how the heck can I beat a cat toilet? Bruh, are you guys stupid or something? Just use a ray of doom and it'll start playing with it. Oh my gosh, you're a genius. Ten seconds later. This is the biggest and shiniest laser I've ever seen. <laughs> Dang, that cat had 40,000 health. Ninja Kiwi, add me into the game now. Don't you dare speak to me with that attitude. I'll give you a pack of prongles. Ugh, fine, I can't resist that offer. You look more powerful than a cat. I am exaggeratedly OP, and I stun everything that breathes. Yo, Elite Defender, there's a new toilet that shoots lasers at us to stun us, but I don't think he'll be able to do that to you if you're far away. I don't know, man, let's go try it out. A few inches later... Bruh, don't you think I don't see you? You're exactly 358 miles away. Yo, Paragons, are you able to beat the new boss toilet? We don't know what that is. We gotta try it. Oh, I've got a bigger audience this time. Yo, Alchemist, can I get a potion that makes us unstunnable? Yeah, sure, but I need an anvil to craft it. Yo, Steve, how can I get an anvil? Well, you can either give me $1,000 or get me some iron to make it. I'm kind of broke, so I gotta do the second one. <laughs> Yo, here you go the iron. Pleasure trading with you, sir. Here you go the anvil. Yo, I don't know how you're gonna make a potion using an anvil, but I'm hoping that it's good. Nom, nom, nom. Did you just eat an anvil? The best potion in the entire world is currently in your hands. Go and use it for good. Yo, the alchemist ate an anvil to make you this potion so you can beat the boss toilet. Go, 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 go. Bro, why are y'all even trying anymore? Pew. Oh, you can't get stunned. That's not a problem. I've still got more health than you can imagine. How much have you got? Dude, that's literally nothing in our game. Ninja Kiwi, they created something that was able to beat me. Oh yeah, you're far too basic. I'll add something more unique this time. Bro, what is this spider thing now? Yo, Dr. Monkey, there's a parasite that was able to infect me and made me pop my dear brothers. Are you infected right now? Guys, there's an infected dart monkey that's trying to unalive us. Dang, this is like a zombie apocalypse. Guys, I can make a containment unit that we can place the dart monkey in. Okay, but I can hold it for the time being. Pew. Don't worry, little guy, I've got four million health. One hour later. Bro, what? How did I end up here? Hello, dart monkey, you have been infected and I'm here to heal you. Are you trying to poison me? As I just said, I'm giving you this because you have a parasite inside of you. Personally, I don't feel like I have a parasite inside of me. Dude, just drink the potion. Go, 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 go. Wait, what? Where am I? Why am I here? Where's the parasite toilet? Ah, uh, hello again, Dart Monkey. You were infected by a parasite and I've saved you. Oh, thank you, but how did it happen? Well, the parasite toilet got inside of you and made you pop your brothers. Bro, what we gotta do something to get rid of that beast. Well, yeah, we've already got an idea. What is it? We'll just nuke it. A few inches later... Tactical nuke! Incoming! <laughs> Wait, why am I here? Wasn't I gonna beat a parasite toilet? Yes, you were, but it jumped onto you and it almost made you nuke us. Oh my gosh, this thing is really powerful. Yes, but I've got another idea on how to beat it. Your dart monkey, can you get me a camo balloon? Yeah, sure, I don't know what you'd need it for, though. Hello, I'm currently stealing you. Okay, I've got it now, what? Just give it to me. One hour later. Here you go, the camo balloon. Bruh, why would I need it? I made it so you can hide under it so the parasite doesn't see you. Oh crap, you're actually a genius. Yeah, I know that. My name is literally Monkey Einstein. 
It's quite cozy in here. Hmm, okay, no towers here now. I guess I don't gotta infect anyone. <laughs> Ninja Kiwi, why are your monkeys so smart? Because they've been taught by the ultimate big brain. And who is that? Who do you think it is? Bruh, what is this little toilet with headphones trying to beat me? Dang, dude, I can't resist the urge to dance to music. Guys, this new toilet makes me dance. And why are you telling us that? Because when I'm dancing, I can't attack. Oh, you should have said that at the beginning. Why don't you just use earplugs? Oh yeah, that's a good idea. A few inches later. You think you're smart now, don't you? Guess I gotta up the volume. Dang, dude, even earplugs are too weak for this thing. Guys, it worked for a bit, but then it increased the volume and everything got messed up. Yo, I know you've got the urge to dance to that music, but if I play my own music whilst it's playing it, I should deafen it out. I don't know if that's gonna work, but let's try it. <laughs> that sounded like something from YouTube Kids, but it somehow worked. Ninja Kiwi, can I try being a balloon too? Why do y'all keep asking me like, bro, just get into the game already? Bro, is this just the ice monkey, but as a balloon? <laughs> Dang, this is even more powerful than the ice monkey. Yo, Inferno, can you come help me pop a chili toilet? That's a sentence I thought I'd never hear. A few inches later. Bruh. You can you beat ice with ice? What kind of a question is that? Well, there's a frost toilet and we can't figure out how to beat it. To be honest, I don't know what would happen since I've never had an ice enemy. But we can either guess or try, and I'm thinking the second is better. Thank you, my good sir. Now I'm bigger. Dude what? Yo, Pat, can you beat ice? Yeah, why wouldn't I be able to? Oh, you mean this type of ice. Ouchie, my hands get way too cold from that. Dude, is this impossible, or are we just too stupid? I think it's the second. Yo, Psy, I know I've already asked you something today, but can you help us beat this new frost toilet? What have you tried against it? The Inferno ring the icicle impale and pat fusty. Are you stupid, or yes, you can just use the first solution I gave you for this toilet, too? Wait, what, dude? You're a genius. I know that already. Yo, Ray of Doom, come with me to beat a chilly toilet. What a few moments later. LMAO, have your buddies given up on helping you? Not exactly. <laughs> Let's see what date it is today. Okay, and when was Thanksgiving? Ah, uh, okay, so it's quite appropriate to add a turkey toilet in now. Have Ninja Kiwi forgotten how to use a calendar? Yo, what's up? I've got a lot of health. How much exactly? Oh yeah, that's a lot for me, but not for the others. Your Paragons, there's a turkey toilet that thinks it's powerful. How much health does it have? Dude, that thing is as easy as the normal Blunarius. Dang, you've got a lot of protein inside of you. Yeah, I know, but you're not gonna be able to get it. Are you sure about that? Nom, 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 nom. Stop right there, criminal! Bro, what I was just scratching my butt. Yo, elite defender, there's a police toilet, so can you come and act like the monkey police? Yeah, of course. Yo, I'm the monkey police, and I'm here to tell you that you've broken 78 laws and you're being searched for in 42 countries. My dude, I know the law better than you. Okay, what is it then? Here you go, it's on this sheet of paper. Dude, why don't you just go somewhere far away so it can't see you and it can't shoot at you? Oh crap, yeah, that's a good idea. Jetpack police toilet is protected by law. You cannot hurt it unless the law changes. Haha, <laughs> stupid monkeys. Ninja Kiwi, you have to change the law now or else I'll use my gun on you. First thing, your gun does nothing to me. Second thing, I'm not the one that makes the laws, I just eat prongles. If you're not the one who makes them, who makes them then? Obviously, it's the mayor monkey. You Can you change the law so we can actually beat the jetpack police toilet? Sorry, dude. The police toilet gave me a valid reason to change the laws. And what is that exactly? He gave me a crap ton of money. Bruh. Yo, Benjamin, can you give me a loan of one million dollars? Nah, sorry, dude. I've spent all my money on ice creams. Yo, Archmage, what can I do for money? Well, I need some zombie heads, so if you go and unalive Minecraft zombies, I'll give you $25 per one. Dang, that's a good deal. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Gosh, this is gonna take a long, long time. Two thousand years later. Yo, Mayor Monkey, I've got one million dollars now. Can you change the law? Dang man, the toilet only gave me fifty dollars. It would have been useful if I knew that earlier. Skill issue. Finally, bro. You, you've already added the frost toilet, so why don't you add me too? Dude, why do you guys keep coming to me to get added? I told you you didn't need my permission. Maybe because you're the only one that's capable of adding stuff in. Oh wait, yeah, that makes more sense. Bro, what is that ugly, disgusting toilet? Dude, you literally scratch your butt. Yo, legend of the night, there's a frosty toilet that bonks us on the head and you can teleport, so you should be able to dodge it. Oh yeah, absolutely. Oh, so you're trying to run away now, huh? Yo, guys, there's a new frosty toilet, and it can splat you using a giant ice cube. Oh, easy stuff, man. I can just melt the ice cube. A little puny fire like that doesn't do anything to my ice cube. Ninja Kiwi, can you please help me beat this new frosty boss? Uh, fine. If you can bring me the sun, I'll ingrain it into you so the ice won't be able to beat you. Okay, bet. Yo, Sai, can you steal the sun? Nah, dude. I'll be meditating for the next 5,000 years. I can't. Ninja Kiwi, I know how to steal the sun, but you need to bring back the Forgotten Tower. Ugh, fine. You're asking a lot out of me today, though. Why was I summoned? I need you to steal the sun for me. Dang, that's an epic reason to get summoned. Thank you for your services, Bloon Chipper. Bye for now. One hour later. Boom! Now you're the sun legend of the night. Why am I so poorly cropped? Because you were taken from a thumbnail. Fair enough. Wait, what? How'd you melt that? Dude, I'm literally made out of sun. Dang, that's a lot of health. Yeah, Ultra Boost, I need to be able to deal more than 3 million damage. How can we do that? Hmm. Okay, well, I can make you strong enough if you just bring me a Paragon here. Yo, Ninja Paragon, do you want a cookie? Nah, I don't like cookies. Okay, well, what about a freshly baked Italian pizza? Oh my gosh, the Mario Brothers pizza. Where can I get it? Just follow me. Where's the Luigi pizza? <gasps> Boom, I sacrificed him, and now you've got insane power. Thank you, Mr. Engie. Dang, this update is crazy and I'm getting mad dough from it. But you're profiting from all my hard work and success and ideas. L plus eat sand plus ravioli. Ninja Kiwi, we're way too tired of popping balloons. Ah, uh, fine, I'll just replace you guys again. Yo, last time when I added you, it was a W, so I'm adding you again. What? Bro, come on, why a literal drill in here? Guys, there's a drill tower that just drills through us and pops us. Don't worry, guys. My iron body will be able to survive the drills. Bruh. What's up, stupid drill man? My body is made out of iron. Dude, my drills are literally stronger than titanium. Wait, what? <laughs> guys, my iron body was too weak since his drills are out of titanium. Oh, wow. Who would have thought? Gang, what if we send out like 1,000 bads? I doubt it's going to have the pierce to pop through all of them. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Are you balloon stupid or yes, drills literally have infinite pierce? Guys, it drilled through all 1,000 layers like we were butter. Dang, this thing is more powerful than we thought. What's up, nerds? I've got a shield that's supposed to be drill immune. Oh yeah, we forgot that you existed. Oh, that's fine. I'll just hold you down with my earthquake until your shield goes away. Wait, what? A few inches later... Finally, bro, five times of shield activation later. Yo, gang, the shield would have worked if it didn't pull out an earthquake attack that made me stay in one place, so it just waited out for my shield to end. Don't worry, guys, my iron body will be able to resist the earthquake. What's up, guys? I've got no idea how to beat it. I just wanted to squash the DDT. Bruh, okay. Well, why don't you just go and try to beat it? Haha, <laughs> you're far too weak. Wait, no. Yo guys, so it wasn't able to beat me, but then it called five more of its drill friends and they got through me. Dang, I guess we're gonna have to take the L on this one. Okay, dude, there's no way that isn't illegal. Well, it was until I gave the mayor monkey enough money for it to not be... Yo gang, there's a new tower and it literally has a saw blade that it uses to slice us in half. Oh, it's fine. My iron body will easily be able to survive it. Ugh, fine. This is the only time that that might actually be true. Go try it out. What's up, nerd? I've got an iron body that's way too hard for you. Bruh, haven't you learned your lesson from the Titan Drill Man? I'm not in school anymore. I don't learn any lessons. That's why you're so stupid.
Guys, that thing must have stolen some titanium from the drill man because it easily beat me. To be honest, I think anything except a dart monkey can easily beat you. Yeah, you're just a worthless piece of metal. <laughs> Guys, guess who's not a worthless piece of metal? Are you able to survive a saw, though? I don't know, dude. What kind of category is it? Cameraman. My man, that's not a category in my books. Uh, fine. Ninja Kiwi. What category are the toilet tower defense towers? I think they're military. You dread bloon. Their category is military. Oh, that's easy stuff, then. Oh, just another worthless piece of metal. Not exactly. Wait, what it should have gotten sliced. Ninja Kiwi, I just got beat by a stupid piece of metal. Can you please buff me? Nah, dude, your breath smells terribly. I'll just add another tower in. Bro, what is this fairy looking thing? Yo, gang, I don't know where all these towers are coming from, but this time it's a tower that freezes us and then uses its scythe to pop us. Oh, that's easy. My iron body can't get frozen. Wait, what can it actually not? I think it can, yeah. <laughs> Guys, I realized that I'm actually black, so I couldn't survive the ice. Okay, yeah, we should have never trusted you to be able to do that. Ninja Kiwi, can you please help us with this sinister TV man? Ugh, fine. What do you want out of me? Can you bring back Blastopopolis? Ugh, fine. Why have I been summoned? We needed someone that could survive a snowball. Bruh. Yo guys, it's snow was so cold that it turned me into obsidian. Wait a minute, DDT, what did you say earlier? That I ate a burrito. No, no, it was something else. The fact that I'm far too black to be able to survive the sinister TV man. Yes, 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 that's it. If you're too black to be able to survive it, we can just send a white balloon and it'll survive the ice. Wow, you're actually useful for the first time, DDT, good job. Bro, what is this white thing? Wait, what, how? This thing is way too stupid. I'm going back to Toilet Tower Defense. Are you just an upgraded version of the Titan Drill Man? Yeah, that's quite literally my name. <laughs> Guys, there's now an upgraded version of the Titan Drill Man, and it does five times more damage than the original. Don't worry, guys. My iron body will be able to beat it. How are you going to beat it if you couldn't even beat the original? I don't know, man. I didn't go to school. Yo, what's up, guys? I think I should be able to use my drill to counterattack its drills. Oh, crap. Yeah, that's a good idea. Go try it out. Both of our drills are out of titanium. You're a smart one. Thank you, thank you. But you aren't smart enough. <laughs> Ew, that tasted like rocks. Yo guys, so my drills were strong enough to counterattack it, but it just pulled me into his core and ate me. What the heck, dude? That's just the balloon chipper, but on steroids. Okay, well, why don't we inflate a balloon so much that he's not going to be able to suck it in? Good idea, but how are we going to do that? I've got the best cardio abilities ever, so I can inflate it. A few inches later... <laughs> Go, my boy, now beat that upgraded drill thingy. Wow, that's one big red balloon, but not big enough for me. Crap, it is big enough for me, but oh wait, it's just a red balloon I can drill through it. Yo, Steve, can you cover my body with bedrock? Dang, that's gonna take a lot of it, but if you can get me a stack, yeah, I can- Dread balloon, it's time to go mining for bedrock so we can cover me in it. Ten seconds later. One minute, thirty-seven seconds later. Yo, Steve, we almost got stuck at the top of the nether, but here you go, the bedrock. Wow, I look epic like this. Isn't it a bit heavy for you, though? Nah, I'm a strong boy. Dang, dude, what's that armor? How can I eat such a big thing, though? Gotta try even harder. Dang, the bulk is going really well. Guys, it was able to eat me. It just had to try a bit harder. I guess we gotta take another L with this one, too. We're taking too many L's today. Bro, ain't no way we've got cars now. We do, yeah, but you don't... Guys, the toilets have learned how to make cars, and they use them to crash into us. The glitch cameraman did something similar, and we sent out round 63, and it couldn't beat it. So maybe we can try the same thing. Dang, that thing is more powerful than the glitch one. Okay, well, why don't we just combine all the ceramics into a big Moab? And how do we do that? Just bump them all together. Dude, what? why do you have so much health? Ninja Kiwi, it doesn't make sense for a car to not be able to pop a blimp. Dude, this is Bloons TD6 logic. You can't be searching for sense. Also, you're the one using a toilet as a car, so I don't know why you're trying to find logic. What are these three weird looking towers? Dude, we make bank, we don't do damage. Oh, okay, so you're just easy. Bruh, we aren't made for that. Yo, what's up guys, how much cash do you make per round? Okay, and how much do y'all cost? 
Okay, then you two get out of here and you can stay. Okay, now let me just drop 15 cash drops. And now I can place 10 of you and I'm gonna get $20,000 from you 10. And now with that money, I can get even more of you. And now I'll be getting even more per round. 12 seconds later. And now it's round seven and I have 93 of you and I can sell you all. And now that I have a lot of money, I can get a VTSG. Bro, what, how am I here so early? Because I have W math skills. Dude, what the heck is this? It's only round seven. Let me guess, you just do a lot of DPS. Yup, and it's 80,000 per second to be precise. Guys, there's another tower that's completely overpowered for absolutely no reason, and it does 80,000 damage per second. Yo, I think I'll be able to beat it unless it does the stupid trick where it pulls up 10 more of itself, as that's been done to me at least five times now. Haha, <laughs> you're too weak. Okay, bro, how did I predict that perfectly? Ninja Kiwi, can you stop the tower from being able to summon a million of themselves as that makes me too weak? Nah, dude, it's like that in Toilet Tower Defense and I don't want to change it as I want the maximum amount of players possible. Bruh. Dude, Thanksgiving was like five months ago. I know, but turkeys are a really powerful weapon. Where did that come from? <coughs> guys, now there's a turkey cameraman and it shoots out a giant turkey at us and beats us. Okay, you guys have to agree that my iron body might save us this time. Ugh, fine, go and try to beat it. Yo, what's up? I've got an iron body and I can't get beaten by turkeys. Are you sure about that? <coughs> How in the heck is anyone supposed to survive such a giant turkey? I don't know, man, but maybe my health will be enough to survive it. How is anyone supposed to survive that one million calorie turkey? Did anyone say calories? Oh my gosh, yes, Blunarius. There's a tower that shoots out a turkey for you to eat. Oh, that sounds tasty. Nom, 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 nom. The point was to make you weaker, not stronger. What even is this spider creature, bruh? Yo guys, there's now a spider TV that crawls onto us and controls us into popping ourselves. Don't worry guys, my iron body won't let that happen. I don't know how it knew he was annoying, but that's quite the W. Let's send out a camo balloon to see if it can see it. Don't you think I don't see you, you little sneakster? Okay, it can most definitely see camo. What's up, boys? I reckon I can just teleport away from it when it tries to jump me and win the game. Oh yeah, we kind of forgot you existed. Hello, I'm here to announce something. What the heck is it? It's that you bloons are weak and our buffs are way too good to be true. <coughs> Blunarius, I need immediate help. There's a tower that buffs the VTSG to an insane amount. Oh gosh, not this thing again. <coughs> L plus ratio weird swamp creature. What the heck, you don't look like a normal toilet tower defense tower. Yes, but I can pop you with one click of a button. Wait, what? <coughs> Guys, there's a new tower that literally pops us with a click of a button. Bro, what, that's impossible? Hold on a minute. Okay, so it does 200,000 damage, but it attacks once every minute. Oh, dude, that's easy stuff for me. I've got 40 million. What's up, weak nerd? Yeah, that does like nothing to me. Bro really thought I couldn't beat him. Guys, that thing resold and replaced itself like 50 times, and it popped me. How about we take a vacation to the beach and we come back to this game later? Yeah, agreed. Meanwhile... Ugh, fine, Talanthric. I'll give you 1% of the earnings of the game. $57 million? Yeah. Let's go! Bro, what is this 240p quality new tower? <coughs> Wait, what? How did you one-shot him? <coughs> Guys, there's an emergency. There's a $200 tower that literally one-shot me. Bro, what the dart monkey literally costs more, bro how? Yeah, and later on he gets more upgrades. What can we send on round six? Well, we can just combine every balloon on round six and make him into a ceramic balloon. And how do we do that? Bro, just smash them all together. <coughs> bro, what the heck it was able to two-shot me? Dude, what I don't think we can do anything else, so we just gotta take the L on this one. What the heck are you, bruh? Guys, somehow they've made a knockoff Ray of Doom at round 40. Don't worry, guys. My iron body will be able to resist the laser. Bruh. Like that's ever worked for you, bro. I don't know how they've sent a DDT on round 40, but it's still gonna be easy. <laughs> guys, somehow my iron body wasn't able to resist it. Ah, yes. Like someone didn't tell you that it's way too weak before you tried it. Wait a minute. Why don't we just send out a purple balloon? Oh my gosh, bad, you're a genius. Meanwhile... <laughs> I'm the best tower ever. Bruh, another weak balloon. Wait, what? 
Ninja Kiwi, I need a buff. I got baited by a stupid William Afton balloon. Nah, you're too ugly. I'll just add in your big brother. Wow, this is a bigger knockoff ray of doom. Yeah, hi again, so we have an even bigger laser cameraman, and it does 15,000 damage per second. Bro, what, how is that possible? Can we send a purple balloon at it again? I doubt that's gonna work, but yeah, we can try. What's this purple thing? Okay, that simply didn't work. What can we do then? Wait a minute, it does 15,000 per second, but why don't we just combine all the bads and make them into a Blunarius? Dang, this new combining thing is a W. What about my iron body? Just shut up. What's this green Shrek thing? Dang, I didn't know that I could actually lose. Wow, you look cool, I'm adding you. Bruh, what is this new thing? Guys, there's a firework tower and it does insane multi-target damage and one-shot us. Oh, that's not that rare, we just gotta send something strong. Ah, uh, we love being on vacation. Ah, upgraded Titan cameraman, come here now, we've forgotten how to attack. Haha, <laughs> 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 you don't do enough damage. Wait, what how? <laughs> Gang, there's a new thing that can summon five of itself, and each does 50,000 damage per second. Bro, what was Ninja Kiwi high whilst adding these things? I don't know, man, but we gotta figure something out. I can go to them and just stun them, you know? Oh yeah, that's a great idea. Dude, we're literally immune to stuns. Wait, what? Yeah, those guys easily blasted me as they're immune to stuns. Wait a minute, Blunarius, why don't you just go in as the elite form? Oh, bruh, how couldn't I think of that? What is this toilet throne that you have, bro? Yeah, there's this new mean tower that bumps into you while it's on its toilet throne and pops you. Don't worry, guys, my iron body won't get popped by it. Ugh, fine, this is the only time that that might actually be true. Hey, my body is too iron for you to pop me. My seat is made out of titanium. Guys, somehow my iron body was too weak for it. Ah, uh, yes, we totally didn't expect that. Wait a minute, can that thing pop more than one balloon at a time? I don't think so, since it'd need to go to each one individually. Okay, but then let's just send out round 63. Yo, what's up? I'm the infamous round that everyone hates. Huh, you don't look that hard. Oh, no. You Can you continue adding more of my brothers in the game? Yeah, of course I will. This thing is way too weak, it can't even pop me. Dude, I'm literally not made for that. A few inches later... Haha, <laughs> <laughs> L plus ratio plus balloons are better. Wait, what, you can't just do that. Bro, can you move off the track? Nah, it's quite comfortable here. Bruh. Okay, then I guess I'll go through you. Yo guys, the shield cameraman just stays on the track like a monument and pops us when we bump into it. Don't worry boys, my iron body will be able to go through it easily. Yeah, okay, that's definitely gonna work. You're back so quickly that you don't even need to tell us what happened. Yeah, it worked. Wait, what really? Nah, I'm just kidding, bro. Don't joke about such things with us. Yo, I think I should be able to stun that thing. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Dude, whether you stun me or not, the shield is still gonna be here. <coughs> Bruh, this is just Gwendolyn, but male. <coughs> Boys, there's now a flamethrower cameraman. Well, guys, my iron body will be able to pass with no issues. DDT, can you learn to keep your mouth shut? Where'd you get that from? Ninja Kiwi gave me it in cases of emergency. Oh, hey, there's a spot for me in here now. You're a lot more pleasant than DDT. So, guys, have you got any ideas? Oh, bro, this one is simple. We can just send it a purple balloon. Why do my fires hate the color purple? Bro, where's the guy that's supposed to be attacking us? It's right in front of you, you blind balloon. Is it you? No, you stupid, it's a ghost. <laughs> Guys, there's a spooky ghost tower and I couldn't even see it. Guys, I'm back from prison and I can tell you that my iron eyes will be able to see it. Bruh. Dude, I'm not even gonna stop you. Just go and you'll see that you won't be able to. Okay, so where's that ghost guy? 
Guys, that ghost thing didn't appear, but some magical power popped me. Oh my gosh, you're so stupid that we'd be better off without you. Frick you guys, I'll go have my Sigma male arc. Tandrew mate, how can I become rich and powerful? Finally, we got rid of that stupid guy. Now, have you guys got any ideas on what to do? Well, that thing does 60,000 damage per second and is just invisible. So why don't we just send out Elite Blunarius like we did earlier? Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Bro. That damage is literally nothing to me. Okay then, bet. Wait, what? Who joined? <laughs> Bro, what is this weak tower that literally can't do any damage to me? Dude, come on. My purpose is to make other towers stronger. You can y'all come with me so we can give insane buffs. Ah, uh, yes, we love breaking balloons with too much power. You, do you want to get buffed to the skies? Yeah, bro, who wouldn't? A few inches later. Oh, a cute little VTSG thinks he can pop me. Huh? I haven't seen that DJ guy before. <coughs> this stuff is way too easy. Didn't I ban you from the game? Well, yeah, but I'm back for some ego inflation. Nah, bro, no way y'all have gotten so desperate to start shooting pizzas at us. Dude, we found out that the pineapple pizza is one of the best weapons that we can use to slow balloons down. Guys, they've added the most absurd tower into the game. What is it? A chef TV man that throws pineapple pizzas at us. I actually kind of like pineapple on pizza. If you were DDT, we would have thrown you out for that statement. Okay, well boys glue can't affect me, so I doubt some pineapple pizza will be able to. Okay, never mind, it easily beat me. I am the fat 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 and also sometimes fat and I think I can solve this issue. Mmm, yummy pizza. Wait bro, you can't just do this? Bro, what is this analytical looking man? We need to build a wall. Bro, no way, that's legal. Trump said it is. Boo! Guys, the scientist tower literally makes walls that we can't get through. Yo guys, I'm back and I'm rich and I live in Dubai now. Dang, that actually worked out for you. Yes, and I'm back here to tell you that my iron body can get through that wall. And you haven't gotten any smarter since last time. Yo guys, it didn't work, and I'm hopping off to Dubai now. Dang, he can actually flex on us now. You noobs watch and learn from the master. Dude, not another stupidly overpowered tower. Yo guys, so there's an even more powerful tower, and this one does 71,000 damage per second. Don't worry guys, we're all the powerful bosses here, and we'll go show that weak tower what power is. What's up, boy? We have 150 million health. Nope, that only did 5 million to us. Wow, what is this shiny gold guy? Hey, hey, stopping time is a really cool ability. Hey, Time Master, there's a new tower that can stop the time and pop us. Can you help? You know, you're a disgusting dirty balloon. I'd never help you. Hmm, okay, I've got a better idea. Hey, I'm the dart monkey. Can you give me something that can stop and unstop time? Oh, yeah, of course. Dart, here you go. This watch that can control time. Yo, what's up? I can also control time now. I just realized that I can't press the button when I'm already stopped, so maybe I can stop him before he stops me. Hey, 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 how is it like being frozen, you stupid clock man? Dude, I can literally move even when time is stopped. Oh, hey, I've got an attack that does 500,000 damage. Dude, I'm done with this stuff. Ah, yes, I love copying someone else's game and doing nothing original and getting a ton of money and a ton of players. Hello, you stupid bird. I'm here to sue you for stealing everything in my entire life. No, you. What kind of an abomination are you? I'm very smooth. Yo, VTSG, there's a traumatizing toilet that cuts us in half. Oh, don't worry, my body is made out of bluntonium. It won't be able to cut me. Dude, what how? <laughs> Dart monkey, there's an emergency. That thing was able to slice me in half. Dude, what how is it that powerful? Yo, Permaspike, there's an enemy that slices us in half, and it was able to slice me too. Oh, don't worry. My body and spikes are made out of titanium, so that should be easy stuff. I guess not from the first time. Dang, that was the most cardio I've done in my life. Guys, that thing was able to cut through my titanium body with no problems. We gotta do something. What the heck are you three doing here? There's a toilet that's able to slice us in half, and it even sliced me, but with a lot of effort. Dang, that seems powerful here. You go this potion that makes you into the strongest material known to monkeys. And what's that material? Oh, I don't know. I found it in my basement. Bruh. Go, 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 go. 
Yeah, you can't do that now since I'm the strongest material ever. Oh, that's not that hard for me. You give me titanium now. Okay. What's up, nerd? I've got titanium saws now. Finally broke. Ooh. You Archmage, that would have worked if it didn't go and upgrade its saws to titanium ones. Okay, well the actual strongest thing ever is bedrock, and you can only get that through Steve. Yo Steve, how can we get bedrock so we can cover ourselves in it? Well the only way to actually do that is to somehow mine it off of the rooftop of the nether, but nothing has ever been able to do that. A few inches later... Pew, 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 pew. Okay, no, this doesn't seem to be working. Ten seconds later... Yo, what's up? I'm here to steal you. Wait, no, you can't just do that. What you gonna do about it? What's up, guys? I got Dreadbloon. How the heck did you do that? Skill. Far too easy. Yo, Steve, I've got this stack of bedrock. Can you cover me in it? How in the heck did you get that? I just stole Dreadbloon and used him to mine it out. Okay, well, yeah, sure, I can cover you. Dang, bro, how heavy is this? Each piece of bedrock is 50 kilograms. Yeah, no, dude, the bedrock is literally unbreakable. Guys, I got covered in bedrock and was able to survive its saw, but it threw a bat at me and that unalived me. Dang, that toilet is really powerful. Yo, that toilet is really stupid since I can just hold the balloon that it's throwing at you. Stillness. Ninja Kiwi, a little blue child was able to stop me from winning, that's unfair. L plus ratio plus you're ugly plus get more smooth. Come on, dude, why a minigun? Yo, Elite Defender, there's a toilet with a gun. Can you go try to pop it? Yeah, sure thing. You so, saw, we were both able to shoot a shot, but his did more damage and unalived me. Yo, I have ten times more health than you, so I should be able to pop it before it pops me. Bro, what the heck is that thing? It literally shot out ten shots in one second. Bro, what, that's even faster than my attack speed. Okay, well, how can we make it attack less times per second? Maybe we can just ruin its sleep. And how the heck would we do that? I can use my dart GPS and find out where it lives and we can steal its bed. Don't you think it's gonna feel that? Nah, toilets aren't that intelligent. Twelve o'clock midnight. The next day. Bro, last night I had a terrible night of sleep since for some reason my bed was on the other side of the world. Even though my bed was in Beijing, my performance is still superb. Guys, its loss of sleep literally did nothing negative to it. Crap, dude. How else can we make it lose focus? Yo, Dr. Monkey, what's a way that we can make an enemy lose its focus? Well, if you don't want to use any machinery, you can just tell it that there's something important behind it. Look, minigun toilet, there's a cameraman that wants to pop you behind you. I don't fall for such dumb tricks even when I don't get my night of sleep. Yo, Dr. Monkey, apparently toilets are dumb enough to not realize when their bed is taken under them in the middle of the night, but aren't dumb enough to fall for that trick. Hmm, they're an interesting species I can analyze. Okay, but what can we do to make it less focused with the machinery you have? Let me see, oh, we can just use anesthesia and make it barely conscious. Bruh, why don't we just do that on every toilet in Bloom? Because it costs $1,500,000 just to use it once, and it's not sure that it's gonna work, and also you're gonna have to pay it. Oh, okay, see you in a little bit. Yeah, how much do you guys pay per hour? Three bananas. 3,000 years later. Yo, I finally got the money here. You go. Can we do it now? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Wait, what? What's that sound and why am I feeling so dizzy? <laughs> Guys, is there any chocolate in here by any chance? <laughs> Congratulations, Elite Defender. You've just won an Oscar for making Pat Fusty fall asleep in the least amount of time possible. Let's go! What in the heck are you? Boys, there's toilet that's like the balloon chipper, but for monkeys. I'm the biggest and the fattest, so I should be able to not get sucked in. Guys, I wasn't big enough and fat enough to not get sucked in. Oh, fine, I'll get bigger than you. Yo, can I buy 50,000 Big Macs? Sir, this is a Wendy's. Okay, I'll go to the better shop. You can I get 50,000 Big Macs? Yeah, sure, that's $50,000. By the way, just from curiosity, how much does it take you guys to make those burgers? $50. Ah, uh, okay, that makes sense. Yo, Ultra Boost, can you teleport all these burgers inside of my stomach? Oh yeah, of course I'm an expert in that. Dang, I'm actually the fattest now.
Yo, Dr. Monkey, there's a vacuum toilet that sucks us in like the balloon chipper. How can we fix it? Dude, I'm not Google. You need to first get an idea and then ask me to make it. Okay, cool. Hey, Google, how can I pop a vacuum toilet easily? According to my sources, the easiest way to pop a vacuum toilet is to hurt it from the inside. Okay, thank you, Google. Anyways, Google Drive is only $10 a month. Shut up. Yo, I asked Google and it told me to somehow hurt it from the inside. Dang, okay, then we can just put a Zar Bomba inside of it and explode it. A few moments later. How the heck did you survive that? Yo, the Tsar Bomba was too weak to blow it up from the inside. What can we do to make it stronger? Once again, I'm not Google. Yo, Google the Tsar. Bomba wasn't good enough to blow up the vacuum toilet. Can you give me an idea how to make the bomb stronger? According to my sources, you can pour acid on the bomb and it will explode with 100 times more power. Thanks, Google. Anyways, Google Drive is on sale to only $5 a month. Dude, I literally do not care. Yo, Google told me to pour acid on the bombs and it'll get stronger. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. No crap, Sherlock. How can we actually use it? It, though. Just get the balloon solver to use his acid on the bomb. Yo, balloon solver, can you come to spit acid on the Sar Bomba bomb? Why the heck would you need that? Well, there's a vacuum monkey chipper toilet and we need to explode it from the inside. Ah, uh, okay, that makes more sense. <laughs> Guys, I just got summoned to deal with the vacuum toilet. Where is it? Bruh. What the heck is this catching toilet? <laughs> You pat fusty, there's a toilet that throws us out of the map. But you're a heavy boy, so I don't think it's gonna be able to do it with you. I'm the biggest and the fattest. Dang, that was heavy, but I can throw up to 500 tons. Yo, can I jump into you guys' oil fryer? I don't know why in the heck you'd want that, but yeah, sure. Okay, so now I'm covered in oil and I'm all slippery. That was slippery as heck, but thankfully I've got chalk on, so I can never drop anything. You ultra boost what's safe for monkeys, but isn't for toilets. Why the heck do you need that? Well, there's a toilet that grabs me and yeets me, but I'm wondering if I can cover myself in something that can make it pop, but still have me totally okay. Dude, are you dumb or yes? Just take this poison and pour it into the toilet whenever it gets near you. Who would have thought that in 2024 we'd live in a society where it's normal to see a 50 tons gorilla pour poison into a toilet with claws and a human inside of it and then flush it. Dude, stop with the introspection and go eat more burgers. Wait, what I heard the join sound effect, where's the toilet? Guys, there's a new toilet, but I can't see it. Can you help? Dude, just put on your red wristbands. Oh yeah, you're right. What's up, stupid ghost toilet? I can see you now. Okay, but you can't pop me. What? Yes, I can. Wait, what? Yo, Elite Defender, there's a phantom toilet, and it teleports away from every attack of mine. But you attack every 0.1 seconds, so I doubt it's gonna be able to do that with you. I don't know, man. Let me go try it. Dude, what? How do you teleport so much? Pure skill and absolutely no luck. Yo, Ultra Boost, there's a phantom toilet that literally dodges every single bullet of the Elite Defender so we can't hit it. Oh, there's an easy fix to that. I can just trap it in a little box. And how can we do that? You just gotta get me some bedrock. Oh, I already have some. Here you go. A few inches later. Alamao, do monkeys seriously think me as a phantom? I can't go through this cage. Ninja Kiwi, this new toilet is impossible. It can literally go through anything. Dude, it's literally made, so you get stronger now. Figure out how to beat it. Yo, Archmage, can you make the Phantom Toilet not be able to go through walls? Nah, dude, that stuff is way too dark for me. Go to the Prince of Darkness for that. Yo, can you make the Phantom Toilet not be able to go through walls? Oh, yeah, of course I can. Okay, what do I gotta do for it? Literally nothing, it's already done. Oh, wait, what I guess Ninja Kiwi was right. Oh, bro, not this thing again. What the heck, why can't I move? Because you're weak, buddy! Okay, bro, this has to be an absolute joke. Here you go, something that's most definitely sugar and not something else. Yo, Dr. Monkey, there's a toilet that looks like Walter White and shoots something that's definitely sugar at us. Oh, bruh, just put on a gas mask. It shouldn't be able to go through that. Guys, there's a Walter White toilet and it shoots out something that's definitely sugar at us and unalives us. Oh, bruh, that's easy. I'm literally a machine. I don't get affected by such stuff.
Wait, what? Why isn't that affecting you? Because I'm literally not alive. Then how are you speaking? Don't question Bloon's logic. Yo, what's up? I'm his student. And what the heck do you do? I use Riz to become invincible. Wait, what? Guys, does anyone know anything about Riz? What does that have to do with anything? The student toilet uses Riz to become invincible. Bro, what since when can the toilets do that? Don't worry, guys. I'll be able to Riz him up. What's up, beautiful? What are you studying in school right now? Shut up, woman. I'm underage. Guys, my Riz didn't work on it. You know what, man? Frick this Riz stuff. Let's just nuke it. A few inches later. Now that I think about it, how did I become a toilet? And why do toilets have to get an education? And why is my teacher Walter White? Your Walter where has all the stock gone? Sorry, Ninja Kiwi. I had to use it to unalive your monkeys. Dude, what? It wasn't meant for that. Huh? Why isn't there any tower on the map? Guys, there's a new tower that's invisible and comes up to us and stabs us. Don't worry, guys. My iron body will be able to survive the stab and my iron eyes will see the tower. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, hell no, man. Can't we get rid of him finally? Nah, dude. We need him for the extra welfare money. Bruh, these other bloons must be schizophrenics. There's literally no tower on here, LMAO. <laughs> guys, you must be crazy. There's no tower there, but the air somehow stabbed me. Bruh. Don't you realize that that air that stabbed you is the hidden tower? Nah, dude, that wind must have been too much. Bruh. Is that welfare worth it that much? Yeah, otherwise we won't have enough money to live. Okay, DDT, can you go search for the Lord of the Rings since we need it? Oh yes, I love being productive. Where exactly is that? It's in the Wizard of Ozland. I don't know where that is, but I'll probably find it. Thank gosh, his parents weren't smart enough to be able to read him stories for children. Yeah, but how can we beat this sneaky tower? Yo guys, I'm camo, so I might be able to see that tower. Yeah, but DDT was camo too, and he couldn't see it. DDT also can't tie his shoes, so I don't really think we should trust him. Okay, yeah, that's fair enough. Oh no, where is it? I guess DDT can see as much as me. Dang, I couldn't see it, and it stabbed me three times, even though I teleported away from it. Dude, what the heck can we do for such a tower? Wait a minute, can it see camo? Yeah, bro, both me and DDT are camo. Oh, wait, yeah. Why don't we just get Dread Bloon? His body must be strong enough to not get stabbed. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, so Maid Sauda, how are you doing? Dude, I'm literally a body pillow. Come on, Dread Bloon, why you too? Dude, can you please stop interrupting my date? Bro, what kind of a date is this? She's literally not alive. Oh, wait, yeah, you're right. Anyways, what did you want from me? Well, there's a sneaky tower that stabs us, and I thought your body might be too hard to get stabbed. That makes quite a bit of sense, yeah? A few inches later... I don't know who you are, where you are, and what you smell like, but I'm ready to take the stabbing. Hmm, okay then. Yo, Steve, can I get the most powerful, the most upgraded, the most overpowered modded Minecraft sword that requires 300 mods to make? Yeah, but that's gonna cost $1 million since I need to get my employees to mine out the resources. Will you please, please give us proper pickaxes as we have to suffer to mine stuff with our current pickaxes? Shut up and go back to work. That was weird, but yeah, sure, I've already got $300 million that I stole from Ninja Kiwi. <laughs> Yo guys, it pulled out the Draconic Minecraft 300 mod sword and stabbed me with that. Wait a minute, why don't we just stab it first? And how would we do that? We can steal its sword and use it on it. How would you steal it before it stabs you? I just gotta use the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu Karate skills that the Maid Sauda body pillow taught me. Seems legit. Wait, no, my normal sword can't stab you. Ninja Kiwi, the Dread Bloon used his pro kickboxing skills to steal my sword and stab me with it. Ugh, fine, I'll make it so it can't do that anymore. Yay, now I can go and pop it. No, I've made it so it can't use the sword with everyone else but you. Bruh. Bruh, what's this giant speaker DJ thing? Oh no, that music is too loud for my eardrums. <gasps> Guys, there's now a tower that plays such loud music that it blows up my eardrums and pops me. Okay, but I'm here to tell you that I've got the Ring of the Lords. What the heck is that, the real one? Nah, I just got one from Amazon. Bruh. Does anyone know what we can do? Oh yeah, guys, my iron ears are too strong to get blown up by such stuff. I really, 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 really doubt they're gonna work, but I can't stop you from trying it. Yo, blue speaker DJ thing, man, here you go, this Ring of the Lords. Uh, okay, thank you, I guess. Now, can you please not blow up my iron eardrums? No, Elmao. 
works like a charm. Guys, I even gave it my ring of the lords, but it still blew up my iron eardrums. Yeah, wow, like we didn't expect that. Okay, but what can we do to deal with it? Maybe we can get some earplugs. You know what, DDT, can you get us some earplugs? Yes, of course, I love being very productive. Hey, can I get some plugs? Do you mean like socket plugs? No, you stupid, I mean earplugs. I'm the stupid one even though you didn't clarify what you wanted. Yeah, okay, buddy. Here you go, guys. I got you the plugs. They're called earplugs, but whatever. Thank you, DDT. This is the only time you've been productive. Oh, and I also spent the rest of the money on your debit card when I hopped by to McDonald's. Dude, how do you spend $4,000 on McDonald's? I had to get some for my friends, too. One beating of DDT later. Okay, now let's see if these earplugs will do a good job. Wow, okay, I'm actually not hearing it this time. Ooh. Guys, the earplugs worked for the first five seconds, but the vibrations were too much and they fell out of my ears and I got popped. What if we just send out Elite Blunarius? This tower can't be that good as it's literally just music. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Yo, what's up? I'm playing my violin. You're the only boss that's okay in the head. Why? What were the others doing? One of them was on a date with a maid sowed a body pillow, and the other was cuddling with one while sleeping. Nah, dude, no way they're that down bad. Yeah, but anyways, we need some help as there's a DJ speaker tower and it plays music until we pop, but you've got a lot of health. Bruh, I literally play the violin. What's some music tower gonna do to me? Yo, what's up, dude? I'm ready for the performance. <laughs> Yo, that music somehow made me lose all my health in just four hits. Dang, that's too powerful. Maybe you can carve out my ears so I won't be able to hear it. How exactly would I do that? You can either use your violin or the 300 mods Minecraft sword. I'd rather keep my violin clean. One operation they tell. Yo, now I haven't got ears, so I can't even hear myself talk, but I'm ready to beat your music. Are you sure about that? Ha ha, vibrations from music for the win. Okay, Blunarius, that didn't work. I need my ears back. Run, operation, they tell. So what exactly happened? Well, the music was so loud that it caused my body to vibrate and that popped me. Wow, I don't know how to help you, dude. Okay, go practice your violin or something. Yes, so, I got my ears carved out, but the vibrations from the music were too much for my body to handle. Don't worry, guys, my iron body will be able to deal with that. Wait a minute. How much does your iron body weigh? Two tons on a good day. Is it a good day? Nah, it's a bad one, so I'm three tons. Okay, that's even better. Go and jump the tower. Wait, we can do that? Yeah, just go above it and fall on it. A few moments later. Ah, uh, I love being the most powerful and most handsome tower that absolutely no balloon can do anything against. Wait, what's that sound? L plus ratio plus DDT is the best balloon ever. Ninja Kiwi, they made a DDT fall on my head. That's a weird one, but okay, I'll make it so they can't do that to any other tower except for you. That doesn't really help me, but okay, thank you. Bro, what is this lovey dubby tower? I make us get 250 lives per second. Wait, what, how? <laughs> Guys, there's now a tower that literally adds 250 lives to their tank of health every second. Bro, what how that much? Don't worry guys, my iron, uh, my iron heart, wait, know what bro? I don't freaking know what any of my iron stuff can do this time. It's not like any of your iron stuff has been useful more than twice, but okay. Bro, stop with all this chatter. Let's send out something strong before they get too many lives. Oh no, there's three of you now. How many lives have you got? Guys, me and ZooMG went and took 60,000 of their 70,000 lives, but then a ton of them got placed down, and now they make 10,000 lives per second. So in your speech that you just made, they have made 70,000 lives. Yep, and while you were saying that they made an extra 40,000 lives. Okay, let's stop talking about how many lives they're making, and let's actually take action. Yo, Blunarius, we need your help as currently the monkeys are making 10,000 lives per second. Bro, what? Okay, in this current form, I have 4 million, and I don't have time to switch to the elite one. Come on, dude, weren't you making only 10,000 per second? Yeah, but we figured out we can place even more of ourselves. Dude, they literally had 6 million health. What, bro? Quick turn into your elite version. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> you don't have enough health to beat me. Why did I even have to speak, bro? Bro, they had 60 million health this time, since even more of them got placed down. Time to complain to Ninja Kiwi for the 57th time this week. Ninja Kiwi, there's a new tower and it's too overpowered. Bro, why are you complaining to me again? There's a TV woman that gives lives to the monkeys. Yeah, that's literally her purpose. Yeah, it'd be cool if she was balanced, but now they've got 60 million health because of her. Dude, what, how is she doing that?
There's like a billion of her place down and they make too much health. Yo, Healer TV woman, how's the job going? We've made 60 million health, so no balloon can beat us. Ah, uh, that's cool, but you're too overpowered, so I'm banning you. Wait, what? Bruh, why are there so many of these lovey-dubby towers now? Oh, hello, beautiful. How are you doing today? Hey, Moab, do you want to come closer to me so we can see each other better? Oh, yes, of course, my dear. Boys, there's a new tower and it shoots out Cupid arrows at us and makes us love it. Don't worry, guys. My iron will will let me resist the urges. Yeah, okay. We most definitely believe that that will work. You're the most unattractive and ugly thing I've ever seen, and you're so disgusting puking five times wouldn't be enough to show my distaste. Yo, girl, are you free this afternoon? I'd love to come round to your place. Yes, I am, but first you gotta come closer to me so we get to know each other better. Guys, that thing said that it loved me, but then it popped me. I can't believe it. I'm depressed and emo and heartbroken. Oh, yeah. It's not like we gave you a warning or anything. I think the bosses might have a stronger will than us, so they'd be better against it. Yo, I'm ready to take on a lover tower. Sorry, Blunarius, but you wouldn't be able to do it since your will isn't strong enough to even resist eating a pizza. Ah, uh, that's fine. I'll just go back to practicing my violin. Boys, I've got the strongest will in town. Common phase W. Oh, bruh, I don't even need the will. I can just teleport away from the arrows. Ninja Kiwi, can I get stronger arrows as the Phazy can teleport away from them? Nah, you're already strong enough. Those evil tricks can't do anything to me, you stupid woman. Yo, Talanthric, are you adding any new updates soon since the content is getting stale? Nah, dude, I gotta get Dafukboom to make more before I can... Dafukboom, make more content now or I will bonk you. Who are you gonna bonk, bro? I literally have more power than you. Bro, why am I meeting this weird monkey? Dude, I could ask the same thing about you. Can you please just meet properly? Ugh, fine. So who the heck are you? I'm the Ninja Paragon, a.k.a. the most powerful Paragon in Bloons. Are you sure about that? Yes, I am. Anyways, who are you? The upgraded Titan Drill Man, and I'm close to being the strongest. How do you attack? Isn't it a bit obvious? Nah, it isn't. Bruh. Okay, stupid, I just use my drills on the toilets. And you said you're close to the strongest. How much damage do you do? My dude, I can do up to 450,000 damage in one singular attack. Okay, that's cool, that's cool, but what would happen if we had a 1v1? I'd probably beat you. Okay, then let's see. Three, two, one, go! Haha, <laughs> 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 weak drill, wait what? Ninja Kiwi, I just got beaten by some weird looking drill man, can you buff me? No plus L plus ratio plus I'm eating my prongles. What prongles? Wait, what? where are my prongles? <laughs> What's this weird futuristic clock guy? You know you can just ask me who I am, right? Oh yeah, right. Who are you? I'm the Titan Clock Man. Okay, so I almost guessed your name. What the heck do you do, though? Well, I just do the Zawarudo and make time stop for everything but me. Bro, what how? Why? What do you do? Well, me and my buddy make the rounds either go backwards or forwards. And where's your buddy? I couldn't find a PNG image of him. <laughs> Anyways, do you do any damage? Oh yeah, I do a lot of damage. Bro, would I only do 1,000 DPS? Do you want me to show you my ability? Oh yeah, sure, that's interesting. Come on, dude, why again? Do you want some prongles that are from Ninja Kiwi? Ew, no. Those things are filled with disgusting seed oils that mess up your hormones and an ultra-processed which removes any nutritional value. Oh wait, yeah, you're right. We don't need this garbage. <laughs> Anyways, how has it happened that we characters from Toilet Tower Defense have gotten into the Bloons universe? It was just that me and Talanthric wanted to make more profits. Bruh. What's that sound? Something is falling. I think we fell on something. Yeah, but I don't really care. Where is the food you promised me? Wow, bro, aren't you gonna ask me what my name is or something? I don't need to since I can guess it. You're the Chinese restaurant TV man. That the guy is not a Chinese. Please do not confuse him with us. Dude, I'm called the Chef TV Man. Okay, Chef, tell me what the menu is now. Why the heck do you want food so much, though? So I can become bigger and stronger and heavier. And why do you want that? So popping balloons becomes easier for me. Oh, wait, you want it for that? Okay, bet I'm feeding you my entire stock. Please, no pineapple on them, though. Sorry, dude, I've only got pineapple ones. No, 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 no. You that pineapple tasted absolutely disgusting. Meanwhile, uh, I love being a fat, 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 fat Blunarius that almost nobody can pop. Hello there, bro. What? How have you gotten fatter than me? I just watched Jeff Nippert, and he said I needed a caloric surplus, and it somehow worked.
You do you use ice too? Yeah, otherwise we wouldn't be meeting LOL. Okay, and what do you use it for? Bruh. What kind of a question is that, dude? Of course I use it to slow down enemies. Can you demonstrate? Yes, yes sir. sir. Ah, uh, it's so good to be this powerful. Yo, what's up? I'm immune to ice. Okay, I've still got my scythe, lol. Bro, your abilities are so powerful, you must not do much damage to compensate for that, right? Oh no, I do a ton of damage. Is there anything that I do better than you? Yeah, there is actually... Oh, what is it? You lose quicker than me, and you also make better iced coffee than me. I need a coffee. Why? What the heck do you mean, why? Your job is to sell me stuff, not to ask me questions. Why? Because you've been hired here by whoever the heck, so you can make them more profits. Why? Ah! Bye, nerd. Why? Yo, what's up? I made the best iced coffee in the world. Why, though? That's what I'm asking, too. So I can now drink it and become more powerful than you, Sinister. Go, 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 go! Ah, I love being in this peaceful land of white and only white with no one to pop me. I've just drunk an iced coffee and I'm feeling energized as heck. I'm actually, it's a drunk, not a drunken. Shut up, nerd. Finally, I'm stronger than the Sinister. Bro, do you seriously think that's stronger than me? Uh, yeah, is it not? Of course it isn't. Dude, I'm done with this. Bro, why is Santa in here? A better question would be, why can a farm speak? Okay, bro, do you make money too? Yeah, that's why we're meeting. Okay, Bruges, how much cash do you make? Is that per round at max level? Yeah, what's yours like? Well, without any upgrades, I do $80 per round, but let me upgrade. And so now with the upgrade, I make $6,000 per round. Bro, what, how much, bro, how much do you cost? Oh, bro, I cost literally $7,000. So now there's 17 of us for your cost, and how much exactly does that make us? Yeah, so you aren't that powerful in actuality. Bro, that's not how my game works. You can only have three of you Santa farms at once, Max. That's fine, we still make the exact same amount as you farm, but we cost six times less. Talanthric, can you please nerf them so I don't have to experience discomfort? Don't worry, bro, they were only for Christmas, and now they can't get acquired anymore. Wait, what, no? Thank you, Malamric, now I don't have any displeasure in my life, yay? Oh, whoops, accidentally gave him a lot of dissatisfaction. You look smart, what do you do? I put walls and the toilets bump into them and die. Wow, yeah, that's cool. I basically do the same thing, but with spikes that pop the balloons. Okay, that's cool, how much do they do? How did that pop the bad? It wouldn't normally, but I needed to show a point for the damage. Okay, cool, let's see if that works for me too. Dude, what kind of magic is this? It's called the magic of video editing. I wish we could have that in a normal game. Wait a minute, did you just do 250,000 damage with one attack? Yeah, why is that so weird to you? Dude, that's literally 500 times more than my damage. Oh yeah, you're right, I guess I'm just more powerful. And how much do you cost? Dude, what I cost $32,000 and you do 500 times more damage than me? Yeah, but I attack only once every 20 seconds. Bro, I attack every 6 seconds, so you're still at least 100 times better than me. Yo, I'm here to steal you to become a Bloons Tower. Wait, but I don't want to become a Bloons Tower. Don't you dare try to steal my towers. Now, Permaspike, can you come become a Toilet Tower Defense Tower? Ew, no, I don't like that cringe Mimidi toilet game that's based off of a cringe series. I guess you deserve a ban, too. What the heck are you, bruh? The glitch cameraman. And why exactly am I meeting you? I don't know, but I can teleport like crazy. Uh, okay, so that's why I can teleport too. What else can you do, though? Nothing else, really. I just use my glitchiness to fight the toilets and beat them. Why are you lying, though? You literally cannot teleport and you just move really quickly. My name is the glitch cameraman and I wanted to make myself seem like I do something related to my name. Oh, okay, that's fair enough. Anyways, do you do a lot of damage? Not really a lot, but I do a good amount. Wow, I think I do about 10,000, so yours is really good. Yeah, but I cost $6,000 so you can get a scientist TV man for my price, and he's better. Bro, how are you so cheap? I'm literally $200,000, but I have an ability which is a black hole, and it can take in literally any enemy, no matter how much health it has. Dang, you're a special tower, and I'm just a normal DPS tower. Can you two fight since I'm kind of bored and my prongles ran out? Yeah, sure, that sounds fun. Special boy can't seem to hit me, huh? Gosh, I hate not being able to stop this toilet. Wait a minute. I'm a robot that has perfectly good legs and I can use them to walk. 
Oh my gosh, how couldn't we think of that? You towers, you're actually so stupid. What are you talking about, bruh? Well, we have legs that work perfectly well. Yeah, okay, Sherlock, what about that? And how the toilets get out of our range. Yeah, that's a thing that happens. Well, we can use legs to reach the toilets and stop them. Wait, what? We didn't think of that. And I can also make us shoes out of pizza to make us move faster. I don't think that's how that works, but yeah, sure, we can try it. A few inches later. Haha, <laughs> stupid upgraded drill man can't even reach me and says he's the most powerful tower in the game. Wait, what how? Two hours later. Gosh, I hate not being able to insta-kill the toilets. Wait a minute. These are toilets and toilets can get flushed and that will remove the things in them. Wow, that was actually too easy. What's up, guys? You've got no brain cells. Dude, what did you find out again? Well, you guys don't realize that we're fighting literal toilets and there's a little flush button on them. Oh, what, we can do that? Yeah, of course. Why wouldn't we be able to? You used to be so stupid. How did you get so smart today? I bought Andrew Tate's new $99,997 course. Ah, uh, okay, now we can send out some fast tower to flush the toilets quickly. A few inches later. Three hours later. Gosh, I hate having to get stopped by all these towers. Wait a minute. What in the heck is stopping me from simply not going on the track? Wait, no, you can't just do that. Yo, we toilets have been really stupid. My man, what are you talking about? We have a track that we have to follow, but who says that we actually have to follow it? Wait, what does that really work? Yeah, I tried it out already. That's a very nice piece of insight. Dang, okay, we can just beat all the powerful guys like that. A few inches later. Ah, I love being the most powerful tower that no enemy can beat. Wait, what, you can't just do that. 24 hours later. Gosh, I hate being so weak that I get stopped by the weakest towers. Wait a minute. Why can't we just send out some powerful toilet in these earlier rounds? Yo, toilets, can we send out a powerful toilet on round one? Wait, no, what, we can't. Why the heck not? Well, Talanthric said that we can't. And have we actually tried to do it? We've never actually thought of doing it, but I guess we can try this time. A few inches later. Uh, I love being the most powerful early game tower. Dude, you're literally the most trash tower that has ever existed. Literally worse than a 000 glue gunner. Shut up. Dude, what, how are you here so early? We turned our brains on and realized we can spawn early. <laughs> Your Talanthric gave me the game for a week and I'm now making it so late game toilets can't spawn in the early game. No. 346 minutes later. Gosh, I hate having to go on the map even if I take the shortcut as they can still get me. Wait a minute. Why can't I just walk around the map? Huh, have the toilets given up on beating us? Wait, what how? Yo, Toilets, I found out something new again. What the heck is it, bruh? You know how we have to go on the map. Yeah, we already found the shortcuts. Yeah, but they're kind of weak since the towers can just be spawned near the end. Okay, then what else can we do? We can literally go around the map. Nah, what how? Yeah, go try it out. One minute, 37 seconds later. Where did you go? Three days later. Gosh, I hate all these toilets coming in here. Wait a minute. Why don't we just make something heavy that can block the track? Guys, I've got a good idea. You're quite smart today. We're willing to do what your idea is. Okay, well, let's make something heavy that can block the toilets from coming in. Dang, okay, that's a good idea. Let's use me as the weight, but I'm a bit too light. Don't worry, just follow me. Yo, Chef TV man, can you get a lot of pizzas for the upgraded Titan Drill Man? Yes, yes, I can give you with pineapple because that's my expertise. That's cool too, yeah. No, 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 no. A few inches later. Okay, now let's see if that's gonna work out. <gasps> let's go! Three hours later. Gosh, I hate being controlled by two game developers. Yeah, same here, bro. They keep fiddling with our stats. Wait a minute. Bro, we're literally machines that have got every type of weapon. Why don't we just use them against the devs? Oh yeah, I can throw pizzas at them. Bruh. Sorry, dude. This is the only time you're not going to be viable. Guys, I've literally got a katana. I can just use that on them. A few inches later. Yo, Talanthric, how are the profits going? Currently, they're on one million dollars per minute. Ah, so just the usual... <laughs> Wait, so does that mean that all their money is now ours? A few inches later. Bro, what is this clock, Dumbo? Guys, there's a new time tower that does the Zawarudo and stops time for everything but itself. Bruh, I'm the most powerful tower, there's no way it would stop me. You think you're more powerful than the most overpowered thing in the game? Dude, you're literally not even close to the most powerful anymore. 
Your perma spike, there's a tower that stops time and beats us. And what the heck can I do about that? You can just lay spikes on the ground, so even if you're frozen, you can still do damage. Oh yeah, that makes sense. A few inches later. Yo, my perma spikes did too little damage, so it has more than 100,000 health. Dang, that's really powerful. Yo, Archie Magee, there's a Titan Clock Man that stops time and beats us. Can you do anything to weaken it? I could try casting some spells to beat it. Bruh, are you having a seizure or something? Bro, my shmashiti shmashiti for some reason didn't work. Bro, not your smashatiti dude, I gotta find something better. Give me the responsibility and I will be able to fix this. Okay, cool, either way I wanted to go play the My Little Pony game. Bruh. You engineer, we need a new time machine. We've never had one, so I don't know what you mean by new, but yeah, sure, I can make you one. One hour later. I don't know where that came from, but it's a W. Goo goo gaga. Oh, you're actually so cute. But Daddy and Mommy have to go to work now since we have a mortgage and a car on finance and we hate our lives, so we'll see you in nine hours. <laughs> Two thousand years later. Oh wait, I don't even need to say anything or fight anything since it doesn't exist anymore. Okay, come on dude, why another one? Guys, I need even more help now. What the heck is it this time? Well, the enemies have figured out how to use toilets as cars, and now there's a car enemy that crashes into us. Bruh, these are actually being creative, okay? Well, I've got the strongest body in the game, so I doubt it'll beat me. Oh, wow, you look ugly. Boys, today I'm getting absolutely mogged by these towers. Dang, you got beaten by a car. Okay, well, what else can we do? Well, I can go and try to beat it since I float on water and it can't pass the water. Where's your water right now? Oh, it's only necessary in the game. A few inches later. Guys, it somehow figured out how to walk on water like Jesus. Don't worry, guys. I'm big boy Pat Fusty and I can throw that thing into space. Common Pat Fusty W, honestly. Haha, <laughs> stupid car toilet that nobody else except me can beat now. Time to go eat 1,000 Big McBurgers. <laughs> Guys, I threw it into space, but I threw it too hard, so it came back 1,000 times faster and exploded me. Bruh. What the heck can we do then? Well, I literally freeze everything around me, so maybe it won't be able to get to me. <laughs> Dang, that ice was slippery. Yo, so it worked, but its luck is way too majestic and it slipped right into me, so he's gotta be paying the maths universe. I don't know what you just said, but I'll go get the engineer to make something. Yo, engineer Mr. Person Guy, dude, there's a car that crashes into us and that beats us. Oh, bruh, is there anything that's beaten the car yet? No, bruh, if we already beat it, I wouldn't be coming to you. Okay, yeah, that's fair. Have you guys tried to make a fake target that damages it? What? No, dude, you give us such good ideas. Yo, farmer, can I get a target made out of hay? Yeehaw, trucker mookier! Yo, Tsar Bomba, I need a bomb so I can put it inside of this hay bale. That's not very conventional, so I very much like it. How did you just hide it like that? Simply no skill issue. 346 minutes later. Huh, this is a weird new tower. Common hay bale W. Come on, dude, why another enemy? I can't see where it is, though. Yo, Princess of Doom, there's a tower that we literally can't see. So can we do anything about that? Bruh, I'm the Prince of Darkness, but yeah, we can. You just gotta put on your red wristbands. But I liked my old pose. And I liked actually being alive, but we all gotta sacrifice something. Bruh, can I not see it again, or is it simply not on the map? Bruh. Yo, Paper of Dominoes, I still wasn't able to see it. Dang, I guess you gotta bring me FaZe here so I can use his camo properties to your advantage. Yo, FaZe, could I please steal you? What? No, of course you can't. Oh, dang, okay. Pat Fusty, I need you to steal FaZe. You need me to steal a face? No, I need you to steal FaZe. Oh, okay, that's easy. Yo, I'm here to steal you. What the heck? You can't just do that. What you gonna do about it? <laughs> I don't know how you just did that, but that's quite the W. Go, 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 go. What's up, stupid ghosty man? I can see you now. Wait, what how? Dude, did you seriously expect your projectile to actually be able to hit me? Your parade of dominance, your potion worked, but our attacks literally just go through it without doing damage. Dang, that's a cool name, but I can't really do anything about that. Maybe ask the Ray of Doom to try to pop it. Yo, Ray of Doom, there's a ghost cameraman now here. You go this potion, drink it now. What in the hecky? 
One hour later. Do you even see me? Yes, of course I do, bruh. I don't know why you expect a ghost to get damaged by a laser. Dude, that thing went through my laser as if it was nothing. Dang, okay, I gotta find someone else to throw the potion at. Yo, XXXL trap here, you go this potion now. Come to help me beat the ghost cameraman. What in the what and why and how? One hour later. Do you seriously think a little puny trap like that is gonna stop me? Yes, of course I do. Dude, what this is rigged. Yo, it first insulted my trap and then went over it with ease. Dang, that's a double combo, but now I think it's time to bring back the Forbidden Tower. Are you sure that's safe to do? Well, it's either that or death from the ghost enemy. Ninja Kiwi, I need you to bring back the Bloon Chipper. Huh, why is that? Well, your good friend Talanthric has added in a ghost cameraman that's literally impossible for us to beat. Oh yeah, he's quite the troll, that's a fair reason to bring it back. Can you guys stop interrupting my eternal sleep? We need you to beat a ghost. Okay, never mind, that's a cool mission to be on. A few inches later. Haha, <laughs> stupid little ghost can't beat the BTD5 powers. Dude, what you can't just leave out of me like that. Dude, I sucked it up, but it literally just went through me and left my stomach. Dang, dude, we're fighting with a really powerful beast. Meanwhile, Yay, how trucker mucker, I love having a billion farms that are all my own. They're not yours since they're property to Ninja Kiwi government. Shut up, trucker, otherwise I'll steal all, all your bananas and stab you till you turn into a banana. Okay, I'm sorry, farmer. Halo Farmer, I'm here to give you this seed which I found next to my booger collection. Uh, okay, I guess what kind of plant is it for? Oh, I don't know. It just appeared there when I reached the 100 boogers collected achievement. Uh, okay, then I guess just give it to me and I'll plant it. <coughs> Thank you for your service, Mr. Guy who plants. That guy must have eaten the booger drugs or something, but let's see what this weird seed yields us. <coughs> let's hope it doesn't make a booger farm. The next day. What in the heck happened here? Wow, okay, let's see how much these are worth. Dude, what these are the first bananas that are worth so much, bro. We gotta capitalize on this. Bro, I'm not here for you to capitalize on me. Then what the heck are you here for? I'm here for you to use me to solve a current problem that you guys have. Do you mean the fact that Pat Fusty is always hungry? Bruh. No, I'm talking about an issue that recently arose. Oh, now I get it. So do you guys have any idea on how to beat it? Nah, I wanna go play Fortnite. Guys, there was a guy who came in and gave me a seed that he found next to his boogers, and that seed sprouted into a giant pink farm, and the farm can talk, and it told that it can solve all our issues. I just need one of you to eat one of the bananas. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no, man. What the Thanks for the info, farmer. But this discussion here is for actually mature towers, and not some slave with a big imagination. You guys will see who the slaves will be. Dude, my body is literally immune to stabs. I need a banana of yours urgently. Haha, <laughs> 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 stupid tower hasn't even drank the potion so he can't even see me. Wait, what? why isn't it going through me? <gasps> oh, you mystical farm, tell me your secrets now. How did you let me beat the ghost cameraman? I'll let my creator speak for me. You, you remember me, right? Yeah, you were the weird booger guy. Okay, well, I'm the creator of Toilet Tower Defense, and I just pitied you guys and gave you a farm that allows you to see the ghost cameraman since y'all were too weak to do it by yourselves. Bruh. And also, its bananas are really tasty. A few moments later. No, 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 no. Perfecto. Ninja Kiwi, we've gotten bored of being enemies. Can we become towers? Ah, uh, fine. Yo, y'all are getting replaced by toilets. Wait, what? What the heck, dude, weren't you a part of our team? Well, yeah, but the monkeys gave me more money. <laughs> Gang, there's a toilet that slices us in half. Weren't they on our side? Yeah, but they got bribed by the monkeys. Okay, well, my iron body should be able to survive that. Ah, uh, fine, it might work out this time. What's up? I've got a body that's stronger than your saws. Are you sure about that? Guys, so it didn't work, but it took it a whole three slices to actually pop me. Dang, you're actually being useful since now we know that we need harder materials to beat it. Where can we get such materials, though? Yo, what's up, guys? I'm the toughest bloon that's ever existed. Oh, yeah, we forgot about you. Can you go and try to beat it? Yeah, that's what I'm here for. Dang, this one is even tougher. I guess I gotta try harder. Guys, that thing just slowed down a little bit and just did like five cuts in one attack and that got me. Dang, dude. That's more powerful than anything we've ever seen. What can we do about it, though? Guys, maybe we can send out a camo balloon to see if it'll see it. Wow, DDT, you're actually being useful today. Thank you, thank you. But your iron body is still extremely weak. Do the balloons seriously think I'm that blind to not be able to see that? 
I just realized that it popped me and I'm camo, so it was pointless to send out that camo balloon. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no, man. I guess you're still useless after all. Oh, now you guys will see who's useless. <laughs> Wait, what, how did I lose? So now do you guys see what the real power inside of me is? That's a very cringe line, and also your iron body is still very weak, so your opinion is worthless. Bruh. Plus you're fat now, so you're even worse. Dude, come on now. Bro, why are you out of all the toilets? Because I get paid the most. Guys, there's a frost toilet that uses his hammer to bonk us and pop us. Okay, you can't tell me that my iron body would not be a good idea for this. Fine, you iron idiot. Go and try it already. This one looks stronger, so I gotta bonk harder. Yeah, I already know that I'm strong. Guys, my iron body would have worked, but it decided to bonk me harder. Yeah, we already knew it wouldn't work. Does anyone else have an idea? Maybe we can bring in FaZe and he can teleport away from the bonk. Faze, why the heck are you sleeping with a maid sauda body pillow? What maid sauda body pillow? I hate body pillows, they're for nerds and geeks and cringe people. Uh, okay, I guess can you come and help us with a toilet tower that bonks us on the head? Oh yeah, of course. What the heck, why can't I teleport? Because I've frozen you down to the ground. Guys, it froze me down to the ground and that made me unable to teleport. What other bloon can we call in to beat this? I can call my brother the gold bloon. What, I didn't know you two were brothers. Yeah, but we're from two different fathers. Ah, uh, so you're fatherless. Now I see why you have a maid sow to body pillow. What, no? Yo, what's up, boys? What do I need to beat? There's a frosty toilet that bonks us on the head with a hammer and you should be able to teleport away. I don't know when they added toilets into this game, but yeah, that doesn't sound too hard. Wow, can I steal you and sell you on eBay for $5? No, thank you. What the heck, how did you do that? Guess it's time for the second attack. Wait, what? Guys, so I was able to survive the hammer. Let's go! But then from the middle of nowhere, a giant ice cube came and fell on me. Bruh. My iron body should be able to survive that ice cube. My dude, you can't even survive the hammer. How would you be able to even get to the ice cube? Oh yeah, you're right, that hammer is just racist to black balloons. Nope, you're just coping. Okay, well what the heck can we do about that? What's up, guys? I'm back from my 10-year-long nap. Wow, okay, there's a toilet that summons a giant ice cube on top of us. I don't remember this game having toilets, but yeah, sure, I can beat it. Guys, it popped me using some sort of hammer. Oh yeah, we forgot about that. Let me wake up FaZe to see if he's got a solution. Dude, come on, FaZe. What the heck is this now? Bro, can you please knock before you come in? Yeah, that's fine. That was a bit late now, don't you think? Nah, it was on time anyways. Can you come and help us as we've got Blastopopulus for the ice cube and the golden balloon for the hammer, but neither of them can do both. Oh yeah, that's fine. I can just teleport whichever one is needed whenever it's needed. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. A few inches later. Oh bro, why you again? What the heck are you doing here? By the way, FaZe, how is it like sleeping with a body pillow? Dude, stop talking about that thing. Bro, what the heck are you now? I'm the Yeeter Toilet. Yo guys, there's a toilet that yeets us off the map now. Don't worry guys, my iron weight will be enough to not be able to get thrown. DDT, you don't even deserve the benefit of the doubt since you've barely done anything good. Once can you please stop talking about your iron stuff? Frick you stupid. Dang dude, I gotta bulk up. Yo Sam Sulek, how can I bulk up to 500 kilograms when I'm only 20? Well, you can either eat a lot of chicken rice and broccoli, or eat 5,000 McDonald's burgers. That second one is a lot cheaper and a lot tastier. You can I buy 5,000 Big Macs and also a McFlurry? How the heck are you gonna eat that much? Dude, I'm a balloon, I don't have a limit on how much I can eat. Nom, 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 nom. You could have eaten them without giving me that traumatic sight, you know. No, that wasn't an option. What is this fat Mr. McFat? <coughs> Gotta try even harder. <coughs> Thank gosh I had Sam Sulek to tell me how to train for power. Yo, Sam, I've become fat now, but that toilet that you've trained is still able to throw me with no issues. Okay, if you want the solution to that, I can take you through my three-month training program that's $5,000 per month and an extra $1,000 per month if you want to have me meet you in real life. Frick you, Sammy Sulecki, I don't have that kind of cash. Hey, Google, I'm already 500 kilos. How can I stop a yeeter toilet from being able to throw me? Here are all the free sources for fat loss. No, you stupid machine. I don't want to lose weight. I want to stop being able to get thrown. 
Here you go an image of a stupid machine from ChatGPT. Bruh. How do I stop getting thrown from a toilet with claws? According to my sources, you can try to cut off its claws. That's actually useful, thanks. Anyways, Google Drive Premium is only $10 a month. Shut up. You do any of you guys have a sword? Why, do you want to stab us slash? Nah, I'm trying to cut off the claws of the toilet. No way you're actually trying. Yeah, sure, here you go one. That's fine, I've still got my other arm. Guys, I was actually able to cut off one of its arms that way. So if two of you come and throw two swords from the side and cut off both of its arms, it won't be able to do anything. Dude, I don't believe it. You're actually doing something productive. Three hours later. Dude, did you give up on that idea with the swords? Not exactly. Dude, what you can't just do that. Obviously I can since I've just done it. Ninja Kiwi, they just cut off my arms, that's illegal. No, it's not the Bloons world is a PvP-enabled zone. Bruh. Yo, what's up, guys? I'm a new tower in here. Okay, cool, and what do you do? Whatever you tell me. Can you do a barrel roll? Not that kind of stuff. I attack every 0.01 seconds, and I can shoot out whatever projectile you give me. Can you shoot out my mad missiles? Yeah, you just gotta give me some... A few moments later. Have you guys ran out of other towers to let a literal cat try to pop me? Wait, what? Dude, what that was so powerful, can you do it with my Ray of Doom laser too? Yeah, just give me one of them. One hour later. Did the monkey seriously think a little cat is gonna be able to do something to a gang of DDTs? Okay, little kitty. How are lasers coming out of a cat's mouth? Bro, I didn't know that cats are able to do such stuff. Here you go, a sentry of mine. Please do that with it. Two hours later. Have the other towers not loaded in? There's no way the player's entire boss defense is simply a little cat. <coughs> Could you tell me where exactly all of those came out of? <coughs> Dude, what in the heck can you do that with my nukes too? Yeah, of course I can. Ten seconds later. Ah, what a beautiful day it is to be the most powerful and most handsome boss in Bloons TD6. Ah, there must be a little kitty near here. Dude, what can you stay here and just help us with all our games so we can beat the balloons forever? No, my friends, I have to go to Battle Cats to help my cat brothers. Adios, amigos. Wait, no, don't go. What the heck are you weird thing? Guys, the balloon chipper has been reincarnated into a toilet and now sucks us in. Don't worry, guys. My iron body will be able to survive him. Let's feed him to the wolves. Nah, his iron body would be too hard for them. Crap, you're right. Let's just feed him to the vacuum toilet. Ten seconds later. Oh, free food for me. Okay, now let's actually think about what we can do. Maybe we can get it to suck in phase and he can teleport out from the inside. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Dude, FaZe, are you seriously doing this again? Come on, dude, I told you to knock before you come in. Too late anyways, there's a balloon chipper toilet and we wanted to see if you could teleport out when you get inside of it. Why do we live in a world where we have to get inside of toilets? Because our viewers need entertainment. What viewers? Oh, forget it, just come and try to beat it. A few moments later. Wow, this is a big one. Oh, bruh, I can only teleport inside of this toilet, that's stupid. <gasps> Guys, I couldn't teleport outside of the toilet. I could only teleport in the different regions of its insides. Oh, bruh, that's so stupid. Wait a minute, are we dumb or yes? We can just send out a pink balloon that's on round 500 and it should win the game easily. Oh my gosh, you're a genius. I wonder what these balloons are gonna send out next. What in the heck was that? I'm done with this game. Ninja Kiwi, we've gotten bored of being towers. Ugh, fine, I'll just make you guys into balloons. Yo, you guys are getting retired. Wait, what why again? Bruh, what is this weird looking balloon? Dude, what how? Boys, there's a balloon that teleports every 0.01 seconds, and it beats us before we even see where it went. Oh, that's fine. I literally attack every 0.001 seconds, so it won't be able to get past my gum. Okay, dude, that's faster teleportation than phase even. Guys, that thing is faster than my gun, so I don't know what's going to be able to beat it. Hmm, I can try to make a potion to stop teleportation. You guys just got to bring me the portal fruit. Your portal fruit? How can I get you? Oh, you just got to pay me 2,000 bobucks. Bruh. Okay, then here you go. Yo, I got it. Here you go. Just make the potion now, please. One hour later. Okay, boom. It's made you just got to splash it on the glitch camera, man. Dude, I'm a cameraman, I'm not a blocks fruit. 
guys it said that it isn't a blocks fruit and just continued to beat me. Okay, let's try another species. If you bring me FaZe, I'll take his DNA and we can make a potion with that. Yo, FaZe, I've got something to tell you. Yeah, what is it? Come closer to me since it's a secret. Wait, why am I feeling so sleepy now? Yo, here you go. The phase right now, he's asleep because of the anesthesia. Okay, cool, thanks. I can take a bit of his blood and we can make the potion now. Twelve seconds later. After a grand total of twelve seconds of work, we finally got the potion done. What in the heck? Dude, why is it doing that? Eh, it's fine. We'll just glue it to the dart monkey's hand with glue that it can easily remove. A few inches later. What's up, you stupid? I've got a potion that's glued to my hands now. What the heck, why do I get teleported with it? And you've got the audacity to call me stupid. Guys, since it was glued to my hands, I teleported with it too to the middle of nowhere. Dang, I don't really know what we can do anymore. Maybe you can go speak to the smart, smart monk, Sai. Yo, Sai, what's a good way to beat a toilet that teleports every 0.01 seconds? Maybe you can just drop an invisible nuke on it. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. You have any of you got an invisible nuke? Why in the heck would we have one? Two hours later. Uh, I love being able to teleport all over the entire world. I just got this baguette and mustache from France. What the heck is falling? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> stupid French glitch thingy. Bro, what is this flying box? Bruh, I'm a camera repair drone. Can you say that in English? I make enemies get back their health. Ah, so you're easy. Dude, I'm not meant to be alone. <laughs> Yo, Blunarius, do you want to come get healed by me? Wait, what? How do you do that? Bruh, I'm from Toilet Tower Defense. Of course I can do that. Dang, okay, let's test it out. Bruh, are you so brave to go against all the good paragons in the game? Bruh, you guys aren't even that good. <laughs> Wait, what? How did you do that? I've just got my little buddy with me. Yo, you're sick. Can you come and help me too? Yeah, of course, man. Time to beat another easy bad. <laughs> What the heck, that's literally illegal. Ninja Kiwi D, there's an illegal balloon that heal all balloons. Can you please remove it? Shut up, you're literally a crossbow master. You're a disappointment to the monkey family. You're literally a tier 5, but you aren't even worth 5 bucks. But you're literally the one who made me. Oh yeah, I overdosed on prongles back then, so I wasn't in my right mind. A few moments later. Bruh, what is this 240p quality balloon? Don't you dare disrespect me. I'm the cameraman balloon. Okay, and what do you do? Well, I've got five health and I can stun. Dude, that stun lasted a tenth of a second. Yeah, I know. I'm very powerful, right? Bro really thought he was strong. Wow, okay, this one actually looks strong. Dang, okay, an actually powerful enemy. Yo, Ray of Doom, there's a cameraman enemy with a shield. Oh, bruh, I've literally got a giant laser that can go through everything. Dude, come on, how do you stop a Bluntonium laser? Okay, dude, he can't be able to stop a literal nuke. You Can you nuke the shield, cameraman? Nuke a what? Ten seconds later. Tactical nuke! Incoming! <laughs> Cripple Moab, we need immediate help. There's an enemy that literally reflected my czar and nuked me with it. Oh, that's fine. My bullet will probably beat it. A few inches later. Dude, how do you even send a bullet back to its sender? Simply no skill issue. Guys, we need immediate help. There's an enemy that reflects back all the projectiles you send at it. Oh, bro, we're literally paragons. That's going to be easy for us. Dude, we're paragons. You can't do anything to us. Okay, but you literally can't do damage to me either. Dude, this is the only time that paragons aren't able to beat something. Yeah, dude, this is actually insane. Are you guys stupid or yes, I can easily pop it? Bruh, how are some slaps gonna be able to beat nukes and paragon attacks? Don't worry and let me just try it. A few moments later. <laughs> this is what happens when you're Pat Fusty level strong. Three hours later. Bro, what is this money enemy? Dude, I make bank for the balloons. Ah, uh, so you're just another weak enemy like the camera repair drone. Bruh, I'm just not meant for health. <laughs> Yo, Moab, how much do you cost to get deployed? $50 per round, and we don't have a lot of money right now, so we can only send out weaker balloons. What if I told you that I make $500 per round even on round one? No way, bro. How do you make so much money? It's a little thing called science and also finding legal loopholes. A few inches later... Ah, uh, I love being a tower that can pop all early game balloons with ease. 
Dude, what, how are you guys here so early? Scientist cameraman joined Andrew Tate's real world and now he makes too much money to imagine. You amputate. Can you teach me how to make a lot of money without moving my finger? Yes, my friend, everything that you need to know about becoming a top G and beating the Matrix is inside the real world only for $1.50 a month. Ah, you sell something that means that you must be a scammer and a grifter and also a dancer. Your logic is broken and has many fallacies in it, but top G doesn't bother with bottom Gs, so top G out. Wait a minute, did he steal my wallet? 346 minutes later. Bro, what are you gonna do? Feed us pizzas? Yes, and I'm gonna do that at mass amounts. Wait, what? And they've all got pineapple on them. Haha, <laughs> 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 stupid monkeys can't resist eating pineapple pizza. You're Pat Fusty, there's a Chef TV man and it gives us pineapple pizzas. You pineapple on pizza is disgusting, but it's still food, so I'm down. Yo, where's the food? Oh, so you want the food? I can give you the food. Dang, okay, this is like a free all-you-can-eat. Oh, this is more than an all-you-can-eat. Okay, I don't care, give me the food. Oh, that's so good, can I get even more? I didn't expect that. Oh no, that's a bit much for me. Yo, it's pizzas were way too much for me, too. Okay, how about we just try to not eat the pizzas? Dude, we can't. It just stuffs them in our mouths and puts them down our throats. Yo, Tax Zone, there's a Chef TV man enemy that stuffs food down our throats. Dude, I literally don't eat food. That's gonna be easy for me. Yo, I literally don't eat food. How are you gonna stuff it down my throat? If there is a hole, there is a goal. <laughs> Dude, this stuff is annoying. Let's just drop a nuke on it. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. A few inches later... TACTICAL NUKE INCOMING! There wasn't any need to make me stronger, but okay, thank you. Ninja Kiwi, I fed the nuke 1,000 pizzas and it became bigger and blew me up easier. To be honest, that's kind of your issue. I need to figure out some business matters. You Talanthric, I think we've got an issue. What the heck is it? The bank says that we make too much money and that they're gonna sue us and take it all. Oh no, whatever shall we do? Oh wait, we can use it before they're able to take it to make the banks fail. Oh yeah, how can we do that though? I can help you guys with that. Oh yeah, we'd appreciate that. Okay, but you have to pay me one million dollars. Bruh. Okay, we make that in like two seconds, so it's not a big deal. Ten seconds later. Wait a minute, that's where all of our money was. Nah, that's only where $300 million of our money was. Ah, okay, so we're fine. Ninja Kiwi, we're bored of fighting these monkeys. Fine, I've wanted to replace you guys for a long time either way. Yo, you guys are getting a lot of players in TTD. Could I add you in my game? Yeah, sure, we're poggers. Huh, a new update Ninja Kiwi hasn't said anything about it. Oh my god, those are my favorite toilets from the Mimipi Loilet series. I love you so much, Ninja Kiwi. Okay, so what's new in here? Yo, what's up? I'm the regular toilet. Are you just supposed to be a replacement for the red balloon? Well, yeah, but I've got 100 health. What the heck? I can't pop that. Ninja Kiwi, we gotta get a buff. These toilets are way too powerful. Fine, bro. I'll just nerf the earlier toilets as they get easier later. Haha, <laughs> 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 bro. Now you've got five health. Bro, Talanthric doesn't do that. I hate Ninja Kiwi. <laughs> Stop right there, criminal! What, how am I a criminal? You tax the government instead of paying taxes. Fair enough, bro. Do you do anything special? Nah, I'm just a bit quicker and have more HP. I'm supposed to be a replacement of the pink balloon. <coughs> are monkeys flame resistant? What kind of a question is that? Of course we are. We have balloons, TD6 logic. Oh god, okay, so I can only stun you. <coughs> Yo, Gwen, can you help me beat this new flamethrower toilet? Yeah, sure thing. Oh, so you brought in a new target for me to stun. Nuh-uh, buddy. Bro, what is this Robocop-looking guy? Bro, okay, it's just another stunning guy. Yo, Ultra Boost, can you make me a shield that stops me from getting stunned? Yeah, sure, here you go. What's up, Robocop man? Try that again. Wait, what? Where did you go? Yo, Ultra Boost Robocopy started going invisible. How do we stop that? Bruh, if he's still on the map, you can just bomb him. Hey, Robocopy, I know you're here now. Expect the nuke. Tactical nuke incoming! Thank God this is Bloon's logic, otherwise I'd be dead. Please don't tell me you're just another toilet that can stun towers. Ah, yes, of course, very original. Yo, Sauda, can you come help me stop this blade-looking guy? Yeah, sure thing. 
A few moments later. Dude, please be an actually original toilet. Wow, that was actually original, I respect that. But what can I do about actually popping this toilet? Oh wait, we've got towers that can attack on the entire map. Yo, snipey boy, come with me so we can pop the glitch toilet. What's up, nerd? Hey, stupid, I'm all bad things into one. What the heck do you mean? Yo, ninja paragon, could you come help me beat this new toilet? Yeah, sure. Uf, so you've got your little buddy here, that ain't a problem. Crap, we need even more. A few inches later. What's up, nerd? I've got the whole village here. Uh-oh. Bruh, that ain't that much. What the heck? How am I supposed to be able to pop you? I don't know. Go figure it out, Elmo. Okay, I've got an idea. Okay, so I just gotta place a farm on round three and then upgrade it to the... A few moments later. And then I'll have three million dollars. What's up, nerds? I'm here to wreck you again. How are you doing, mate? What the heck? You can't just get that on round 60. You guys have never seen as much health as me. Why? How much have you got? Oh, that ain't that much. The heck you mean? Yeah, Blunarius used to have 40 million. Okay, but I spawn on round 50. That's not bad, but I've got 1 million dollars because of Punji's guide. God darn YouTubers. <laughs> What's up, skill issues? I've got 8 million GP. It's pronounced HP, and also yo weak, buddy. Another one of these weak toilets. Oh, you don't know what you're going up against? Yes, I do. You're just a stupid turkey. Nah, bruh. I'm the most powerful toilet in the game. The other powerful one I met, it was like 3 million HP. Nah, bro. I'm nothing like that. Okay, then how much health have you got? Bruh! I've only got 40 million HP. Yo, I realized that a literal robotic turkey head in a toilet shouldn't have 10 times more health than a scientist toilet. So now you've been nerfed to 4.1 million HP. Bruh. So now you've only got as much health as my normal form. Well, yes, but I also have the ability to stun literally everything on the map and also have 41 million HP if there's five players. Oh, if there are four players, I get 65 million health. Okay, bruh, but guess what? What? I can stun you too. Huh, you don't look very powerful. Bruh, I'm one of the most powerful towers. You don't really look like it, but okay, what do you do? Bruh, okay, well I just shoot out, uh, I don't even know, but it does a lot of damage. That's boring. I shoot out five different types of attacks, and four of them are made from different types of sacrifices. Okay, that's cool, and how much damage do you do? Bruh, what, how do you do so much? It ain't that much, how much do you do? Yo, dude, I'm better than that guy. Ah, uh, yes, a little spider TV is better than a giant upgraded titan, that makes sense. Yeah, lol, I literally am, I do. That's kinda good, but it ain't really since I do 255k DPS. Hold on, bro, you gotta meet a guy. Bro, why am I meeting a black robot? Do not ever say that ever again, I'm the most powerful tower. You can't be more powerful than me, I'm literally OP. Okay, bro, what do you do? Well, I just shoot out a pewy pewy purple laser from the middle of my chest. That's cool, and how much damage do you do? Well, I'm the most powerful tower, and I do. Huh, yeah, that's an alright amount. Bruh, what do you mean it's alright? Well, it's just because I do. Bro, what can you come to Toilet Tower Defense to wreck all the bosses? Yeah, sure, why not? Bro, what is this dumb-looking black guy? Elmo, I'm literally better than all you combined. Pfft, okay, you weirdo. <laughs> Am I supposed to be meeting a scientist camera? Yeah, of course, bro, we both give cash. You don't really look like it, but okay, how much do you give? $1,000 per round, but I only cost $5,000, so it's pretty worth it. Wow, bro, what my max upgrade only gives $7,500 a round, but it costs over $100,000. For your price, you can get 20 of me, so you can make $20,000 per round. Wow, that's cool, but my only question is where do you get the money from? Well, I go into the White House using my invisibility potion I've made. I go into their top secret room and just turn on the money printer. Bruh, I'm actually being serious. Okay, okay. I trade the toilet souls with the devil for five cents per soul. That's a little more believable. Yo, what's up? I'm the BFB. Yo, I'm the boss toilet 2.0. Okay, which round do you spawn on? Oh, that's so early I spawn on. You must have a lot more health than me then. I don't know, man. I've got... Bruh, that's so trash. I've got... 
Well, yes, but one health in my game is equal to 100 in yours. Wait, what? So I'm actually equal to about 300k HP in your game. Well, yes, but I'm a toilet, so I'm cooler. There's nothing cool about being a toilet. That was absolutely sick, bro. I know, right? It's so nice having another fast buddy. Yeah, but wait. Which one of us is actually quicker? I don't know, man. What kind of speed stats have you got? Wow, that's very good. What are your stats like, bro? That's all right if you've got good health. I don't know if it's good, but I've got... Bruh, I've only got five. Wait, you've got a better guy to be meeting. Bruh, why am I meeting a toilet? Because I'm very much like you. Oh, how is that? Well, I've got extremely fast speed and also 480 HP. Wow, that's the same health as me. Have you got any immunities? Nah, I don't do you. Well, yes, I'm lead camo and also black, so I'm immune to a lot of towers and can only get popped by late game towers. Bruh. I don't have anything like that. How are you so powerful? We haven't had a race, so we don't know if you're faster. Okay, let's have one. Three, two, one, go! That guy is so slow, I guess I am better than him. Bro, renting a czar for only $5 is absolutely ping. Yo, what does your bazooka do special? Well, nothing really. I just shoot out a powerful rocket that goes boom. Uh, I expected at least something. Why do you do anything? Well, yeah, I've got three abilities. The first one stuns balloons. I don't think we've got that in my game. The second one makes mortar target the mouse. Why would he want to kill a mouse? And the third one makes all bombs and mortars attack faster. Okay, those are some pretty cool abilities, but what is your damage like? Well, I'm mainly a support tower, so my DPS is only 20, but with the abilities, it's like 40. Oh, that's worse than I thought mine is. Well, yeah, I'm support and you aren't. It makes sense. Dude, I literally do 100 times more damage than you. You're garbage. <laughs> Striker, where are our Doritos? <laughs> Bro, why am I meeting a speaker? Because we're the literal worst towers in our games. Oh, that makes a bit more sense. What do you do? Well, I'm the speaker man, and I just yell at the toilets until they decide to die. That doesn't seem too bad. Well, it is because in my upper tiers, I barely do any damage. Oh, how much? Bruh, if that's barely any damage, then I do L amounts of damage. No way you do less than me. Well, yes, I don't, but I do. That isn't that bad, actually. Well, yes, it is because I cost 100 times more than you. Okay, never mind. It's really bad. Why have you got plungers on your back? Because I'm a stealthy ninja. And how do they help you? Well, I use them to deceive the enemy. Okay, stop with this wishy-washy stuff. What do you actually do? Well, I just use my plungers to kill the toilets. Do you throw them? Nah, I just kind of punch the air and somehow kill the toilets. That's got literally no logic. And either way, what does it have to do with being a ninja? I don't know, man. I'm just named this way in the game. Bruh. I am exaggeratedly over. OP and I stun everything that breathes. Bruh, no way. Why are you OP? Well, I've got a lot of health and I'm the strongest boss toilet in the game. How much health? What are you laughing about? Bro, if that's a lot of health, then I'm a literal hospital. Why? How much have you got? I realize that I can't blow up anyways. Have you got any abilities? Well, yes, I'm able to steal buffs off of towers to use them for my own health, and also stun them, and I'm also able to revive undead Moabs. Bro, I just get a dumb little stun. I'm done with this. I can make your creator meet mine if you want. Oh, yes, yeah, sure. Make your toilets better, you stupid creator, cause your toilet lives matter. Ah, uh, fine! Let's go! What's up? I'm the airplane toilet. What's up, man? What do you do? Well, I just zoom over the city, and when I find a good spot, I drop a big bomb on there to stun the towers. Oh, so you're an enemy? In my game, the enemies can't attack at all. Oh, yeah, no. In mine, it's normal for an enemy to get fed up and start dropping nukes on the towers. Thank God our enemies aren't like that. Where did you go? Yo, DDT, why don't you go steal the Tsar Bomba Bomb and use it against him? Oh, crap. That's a really good idea. Ah, uh, yes, I really love having my bomb. What the heck? Yo, bro, guess what? I got myself here. Oh no, please don't use it on me. Bro, that actually works no way. Yo, Talanthric, how'd you come up with the idea of Toilet Tower Defense? Oh well, Pet Simulator X started dying, so I decided, huh, why not make my own game? And I got a friend of mine, gave him coffee and four hours of sleep every night, and boom, now we're here. So it literally took you less than a month to get more success than me for five years straight? It seems like it, yeah. I'm done with this. I guess I'll just take over the Bloons development. Yo, Bloons community, I made a new update to Bloons. Huh, you don't look like Ninja Kiwi, but okay, what is it? Well, now every single balloon is inside of a toilet and each one has a special ability and there's a new cameraman monkey. Oh my god, that's stuff from my favorite series, Kibiti Toilet. I absolutely love
love you, Talanthric. Bruh, I'm a literal goddess, and I'm meeting a broken TV. Yes, are you so mighty that I'm under your level? I can either say the truth or be nice. Yo, sorry for being late. I don't know why Adora thought she was supposed to be here. Oh, that makes more sense. What does your fire do? Nothing really special. I've just got two abilities, one of them being a wall of fire and the other a map-wide fire attack that buffs towers. I do like 150 DPS. That's kind of trash I do about 1,000 DPS. Well, yes, but you don't look like you're fireproof. Why is there a toilet in here? Bro, stop being racist to toilets. Okay, then who are you? I'm the normal toilet from Toilet Tower Defense. Bro, is that the cringe game based on Skibidi Toilet? Yeah, but bro, it's not even cringe. Okay, whatever, how much health have you got? What the heck, I've only got one. Told you Skibidi Toilet is good. Bro, why do you look like that? Because I'm a W... Okay, but what are you- I'm the boss toilet from TTD. I guess you could say that I'm a boss too. Which round do you come out? Round 20 on easy mode. Oh, bruh, that's so early. That must mean that you have less health than me, right? I don't know, man. I've got 38,500 GP. Bro, what? I've only got 200. Sounds like a skill issue. Big boss, man. Who are you? I'm the final boss toilet 3.0. So you're the final boss? Yeah. Okay, how much health do you have? It's a lot, but to be more precise, it's- Bro, what are you laughing about? Man, if that's a lot, then I'm a literal tank. Why? How much do you have? Why the heck am I meeting a camera? Because I'm an engineer just like you. Oh, that's cool. What do you do? Well, I spawn cars that go vroom vroom that do a lot of damage to the toilets. I kind of do the same thing. How much damage do you do? Well, I do 33 DPs with the camera toilet. That's pretty good. It's like mine. But on my final level, I do 2,500 RAM DPs, and I also have a laser that does 2,000 DPs. Bro, what? That's so much. Okay, then you must cost a lot more than me. How much are you? I'm pretty expensive. I'm $6,000. Bro, what are you on about? I'm literally $40,000. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you look like a big man. What do you do? I'm basically just an overpowered tower that does big damage. Oh, okay. How much damage is the big damage? About 20,000 damage per second. Hey, that isn't that much. Oh, really? How much do you do? What the heck? How, how much do you cost? Oh, that makes sense. Are you spammable? Nope, I can only be put once. Okay, well, I'm spammable, so you can put 1,300 of me for your price. Wait, I've got an idea. Nom, nom, nom. Bro, I'm not scared of some crusty skelly toilet. Who you calling crusty, bruh? You've got a skull emoji in you. You are literally one, but okay, what do you do? Not really anything special. I'm just an enemy in TTD. Okay, how much health do you have? What the heck, how so much? Well, it might be because I appear in the late game. Which round? Wave 44. Bro, what I spawn on round 80 and I've only got 400. Seems like a skill issue. Bro, why does a toilet have spider legs? Because they make me move faster. Oh really, how much faster? About 50% faster than a normal toilet. Bro, that's kinda slow. Helicopter, helicopter! Bro, don't you realize that we all are flying? Wait, what? Yeah, we're literal blimps. Okay, but does that make you do unique things? Nah, not really. Okay, well, I'm able to throw a bomb that stuns multiple towers. Bro, what? And at least do you have a small amount of health? Nah, I've got 900,000. Why am I meeting a TV? Because I do the same things as you. Oh, wow, how- Well, I spawn barriers on the map that stop enemies. And how much damage do they do? Well, at my last upgrade, I can do 6,000 damage. What the heck? What, how much do you do? Bro, at my tier 5, I can only do up to 500 damage. Wow, you must be, like, really cheap. Bro, not. I'm not. I'm about $50,000. Oh, that's about 10 times cheaper than me. This stuff is unfair. A flying camera attack helicopter seems like the pinnacle of tower defense. Bro, stop roasting my epicness. Okay, but what do you do? I thought it was pretty obvious I shoot out rockets at the toilets. Alright, makes sense. How much damage do they do? About 500 damage per rocket. BRO, what? How do they do so much? It ain't that much in my game. Okay, then do you want to have a fight? Yeah, sure. What the heck a spider toilet? Bro, I'm the most powerful toilet in my game. You don't look very powerful. I think I do. Are you more powerful than me? I don't know, man. How much health do you have? I think I have more than you. Why the skull emoji? Bro, if that's a lot of health, I'm a doctor. Why, how much do you have? I'd zajdoshed, bro. At least I can stun towers. Stop trying to find cope. Bro is for real the troll face. Yeah, but who are you? I'm the DDT. I'm the fastest enemy in my game. Oh, so that's why we're meeting. I'm the fastest too. How much faster are you than a regular one? Two times faster. Oh, I'm four times faster. You must have less health than me then. I don't know, man. I have... Oh, that makes sense. I have... Bro, not another one of these toilets. Dude, I'm a pumpkin toilet. That's a weird combination, but okay, what do you do? Well, I'm the final boss. Cool, which round do you spawn on? Round 50. Oh, that's so early. I spawn on round 120. You must have much more health than me. I don't know how much do you have. Yeah, that's a lot less than me. I've got... 
Bro, not this Giga Chat again. Anyways, I'm equal to you, Moabs. Weren't you the final boss? I thought I was, but I realize there are many toilets over me. Okay, if you're equal to me, you should have about as much health as me. I don't know, man. I've got... What the heck? How have you got so much? Eh, it ain't that much. Bro, yes it is. I've only got... Seems like a skill issue. Hey, VTSG, do you want to meet Titan Telescope? Uh, sure, I guess. Hey, Titan Telescope, what do you want, ugly, and who the heck is this Dumbo? How do you not know I'm the VTSG? The Vanessa Torn Sea Goose? How the hell did you even think of that name? My dude, I'm the vengeful true sun god. Okay, but you're still ugly. Bruh, I'm a purple robot and I don't even know what you are. How dare you say that I'm an elite level Titan Telescope? Bruh, you ain't even elite, you're very weak compared to him. No, I'm not, I've got five powerful abilities. If you're so powerful, what's your general setup? Well, I've got a lot of HP. You guys die from the enemies? Yeah, of course we can't not die, dude. Bro, that's such L design, the balloons can't even touch us, but we can touch the balloons. VTSG, we don't touch the balloons, we don't do that kind of stuff. You guys are weak. You are dumb little monkeys don't that you can't dare even do call anything for themselves monkeys. except you for all popping have to kill balloons. Stupid you are boxes absolute we garbage have to save and the can't kill the boxes invasion, and the toilets while the that we- Didn't I just meet you? No, I'm the Ultra Titan Telescope. Oh, okay, what do you do? Well, I've got a lot of abilities, but the first one is flame from the middle of me. Second one is a gravity gun that grabs any enemy near. The third one is just simply performing a stomp. The fourth one is using my neon blade, grabbing it with both hands and smashing it into the ground, which creates a giant shockwave. And the last one is blasting out a large orb, which explodes if it touches anything. Bruh, that's very boring. I've got five types of attacks, and four of them come from sacrificing powerful towers to me. And I do 255,000 DPS like a Jigachad. Ah uh, yes, a Jigachad. I'm the most powerful unit in my game, but I don't have anything to measure my damage with what would happen if we combined i don't know i guess we could try wow i'm a booger now yo booger man you're so weak you can't pop me okay you weirdo yo i'm the g-man from superbox siege defense you that's a cringe skibidi toilet game bruh no we don't even have any cringe part of skibidi toilet it's just titans vs toilets it's cool i promise okay i guess i'll trust you what do you do well, I'm one of the main and strongest toilets in the game, and I can unalive most small units. So if you want to beat me, you gotta be a big titan. Okay, cool, and how much health have you got? I've got 4,000 health without my insides and 16,000 with my insides. God darn, that's really powerful. Have you got any abilities? Well, no, but when I'm fortified, I have 25,000 health, and I get strongest with rounds. So when it's round 106, I have 85,000 health. Me pregunto que me dirías si pudieras hablar. Hello, I do the flying quite often. Dude, we're balloons. We literally always fly. Oh, I'm the supreme speaker guy. What's so supreme about you? You just have speakers on you. Bruh. They're not just speakers. I use them in powerful ways to unalive the box toilets. Like what? I put on orange justice and start dancing to it. Is that what your supremeness is? Oh no, I can also fly with a jetpack, I can stomp on the boxes, I can shoot lasers out from my speakers, and I can also punch the boxes. Okay, that's more like it. Are you good in your game? I don't know, to be honest, all the tier lists I find online are contradicting each other. Bruh. Okay, well I do exactly what the VTSG does, but with two times less damage, so I'm the second best non-Paragon tower. Did you forget about my existence? Shut up, nerd, you're a modded tower. So you created a skibidi toilet game, and it took you five minutes and you now have more success than me? Yup, exactly, but it actually took me four minutes. Okay, man, I'll just leave the BTD6 content creation to you. I'm out now. Time to absolutely explode this game. Who the heck are you? Hello, community. I'm the new owner of BTD6, and I made an update that took me three minutes. So now every balloon is in a box, and every tower has a Titan and Cameraman version. I know you guys will enjoy it a lot. Oh my god, that's a reference to my favorite series, Mimidi Coilet. I love this so much. Hey, I knew I was a good game, Deva. Yo, Ninja Kiwi, take a look at this. Take a look at what? We'll get the heck who? Bruh, why am I meeting a head in a box? Dude, we're both the weakest enemies in our games. And which game are you from? Superbox Siege Defense. Wasn't it Skibidi Toilet Siege Defense? Well, yes, but the creator of Skibidi Toilet copyrighted the game and we had to change it. Ah, uh, that makes sense. Do you do any special things? What, of course not. I'm just a weak enemy. Okay, then how much health have you got? I don't know exactly, but the wiki says that it's low. Bruh. Mine is only one, so yours is probably higher. Yeah, and I actually take some beating to get oofed and you just get popped by a sharp object. At least I'm not based off a cringe series. Bruh. Didn't they just say you couldn't use the toilets? Well, yeah, but this is an old picture of me. I'm now in a box. Ah, uh, okay, fair enough. Do you do anything special? Well, no, I've just got a bunch of health. Same here, bro. How much health have you got? 
That's about as much as me I've got. Does your health increase with the rounds? What? No, who does that? I do at round 100. I have like 400 health. Wait, I just learned how to read and read on the wiki that I've got a special laser I shoot at the towers. Bruh. We are the metal boys. I am the downfall of all noobs. <laughs> I am the, uh... I don't do literally anything special. Bruh, haven't you got an immunity to any type of attacks? Well, no, I actually only two hits to get oofed, and my only special thing is that they need to be on the head. Yeah, you're kind of trash. Have you at least got a good amount of health? Well, no, the wiki only says that I've got low health, but I've also got a bigger version of myself, and I do good damage to the towers. Oh, I've got a bigger version of myself, too. You know, I'm the big black camo lead fast up DDT. Oh, that's cool. The only thing different from my little form is that I've got a new stomp ability that can stun towers. That's cool. I can't get attacked by bomb shooters. I can't get popped by non-camo seeing towers and the towers also got to be able to pop lead. So that's only like 5% of the towers. Well, yes, but I spawn on round 90, so they've got time to get them. I've got pretty high health. What about you? Same here. I've got 400. Bro, I'm a ninja too, but I haven't got any swords. If you don't have swords, then what do you use? Well, my top path just throws out eight shurikens. My middle path has an ability that slows down all bloons on the screen, and my bottom path shoots out a really powerful grenade at Moab's. That's cool, I've got three abilities too, and they just a heal, create a force field, and a slide towards the enemy. Okay, how much damage can you do? Well, I don't really know, since the wiki doesn't say. Bruh. But do you want to have a fight to see which types of attacks are better? Yeah, sure, you're easy stuff. Three, two, one, go! Uh-oh. Yo, I'm the sentry champion. What's up? I'm the sentry camera woman. What do you even have to do with a sentry? Well, I've got an ability that turns my head into a turret, and I can see where every toilet is, and I do 50 damage to it and stun it for a while. Ah, uh, so you're the sentry yourself. What I do is I spawn a bunch of sentries that explode after a while, and 50 damage is quite a bit, but my sentries do 100. I've also got another ability that spawns a bunch of cameramen and large cameramen. Oh, so we are about equal. Yo, I'm the fast box. How can a box even be fast? I've got a literal thruster on the back of me. A fast balloon makes less sense. Okay, fair enough. How fast are you? I don't know, to be honest. The wiki just says that I'm fast. Bruh. What about your health? Well, I've got pretty low health, but I can damage the units quite quickly. Okay, do you want to have a race to see how fast you actually are? Yeah, sure. Bruh, that guy is actually so slow. Guys look a new enemy. Wait, what? Yo, what's up, man? I'm the Thunder Man. Yo, I'm the VTSG. What do you do? Well, I've got six abilities. The first is a Titan Punch onto the toilets. The second one is a Sound Wave that does good AOE. The third one is a Thundercloud, which is insane for AOE, too. The fourth one is a Shock Wave. The fifth one is a Hammer. And the last one is a Teleportation. That's pretty good. I've got five attacks, and four of them are made from different sacrifices of towers. <laughs> Yo, let's go another sniper, buddy. Yeah, bro, how many paths have you got? Three, and in the next couple of years, I'll be getting a Paragon. Oh, dang, that's sick, but I've only got one path. That's a bit of an L. What does it do, though? Well, at my last upgrade, I attack slowly, but do 32 damage, and at the one before that, I attack two times faster, but do 22 damage. So you're basically paying to get less DPS? Yeah, I don't know what below what thinking whilst making me. Do you want to try to pop a Moab? Yeah, sure, it's just a balloon. It should be easy. <laughs> Bro, what is this bullcrap logic? A balloon is not supposed to be able to tank a bullet shot. Bruh, no way you seriously died to that. Can I try beating one of your enemies? Yeah, sure. Bro, what is this new guy here? Your absolute worst nightmare. Yo, I just beat Fallen King in three shots. Why am I meeting a beefy gorilla? Because I'm a better version of you. Oh, really? What do you do? Well, I can do a lot of things, but the main thing like yours is that I can buff towers near me by making loud noises to make towers scared and attack more. Oh, cool. How much do you buff towers around you with? Wow, that's pretty good. I buff towers by 30%. What would happen if we both buff the most powerful tower? Oh, bet. Let's do it. You activate your ability first, so I get the 30% on your 3 damage. Bro, why do you look so unpolished? Because I'm from the old TDS. Oh, what are you different from the new one? I don't know, I hate those new dumbos. Okay, well what do you do? I do the shooty shooty and leave burn on the enemies. Oh cool, how much damage do you do? Well, zero since I wasn't ever actually added into the game. Bruh. Hello, I'm the old TDS farm. Bro, why do you look like you're growing coconuts? Okay, bro, I can upgrade myself. Wow, bro, I can do that too. 
Anyway, so what do you do? Well, I give what $500 every round. Bro, that's so trash. I give like $20,000 per round. All right, but I give cash to every player in the game. All right, but that's still way worse than me. Green Scout OP. Free Dart Monkey OP. Wait, haven't I met you already? Well, no, but actually, yes, since I'm the old version. Oh, okay, then what's different in you? Well, I don't really know, but I do a different amount of damage. How much at max? Bruh. Bro, how are you so trash? I don't know why Below made me this way. Below either make me better or I'll shoot you in the head with my gun. My brother, that gun does so little damage that it can't even damage me. <laughs> Just tell me how much damage you do. Bro, who are you, you weak-looking guy? What are you on about? I'm a level 50 crook boss, you dumbo. Oh, I'm sorry, my good sir. Nah, it's all right. What do you do, though? I do the pew-pew with magic. What about you? Well, I do the pew-pew with guns, too, but I also spawn mafia members on the map that just bump into the enemies and try to unalive them. Wow, that's pretty good. I kind of do something like that with spawning a phoenix in the middle path. Yo, I'm the sentry. Oh, same here, bro. What do you do? Well, I just shoot out simple bullets that do all right damage. Huh, that's cool how much damage. <laughs> bro, I only do one. Hold on, let me upgrade myself. <laughs> now on this one, I can do two damage and five pierce, so about ten damage in actuality. And how much do you cost? <laughs> but that's for a tower that creates multiple of me. All right, well, I cost $18,000 for a singular. Huh, yeah, so we're pretty similar. That's the most off-brand mortar I've ever seen. Yeah, bro, because I'm from the old TDS. Oh, cool. What kind of upgrades have you got? Well, I have big boom booms with giant explosion radius, and they do a ton of damage. I've got this same type of upgrade, big boom booms with lots of damage, but I also stun. Oh, cool. How much damage do you do? Bro, what? I only do 50 damage. And how much DPS? Yeah, that's kind of trash. I attack twice per second. Helicopter, helicopter, Wait, we already met, didn't we? Well, yeah, but I'm from the old TDS. Oh, okay, what are your upgrades? Well, I've got a minigun and also five missiles that have got explosion splash damage. That's pretty cool. That's pretty much like my Apache Prime upgrade. Okay, and so how much damage do you do? Well, about 90 DPS, but I can also do more if the missiles hit more enemies. That's all right, I do about 400 DPS. Okay, but you can get four of me for your price. Someone had to teach them the importance of good defense. Sing, 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 sing! I get it, bro. You've got a knife, but I've got a sword, which is a million times better. All right, but mine is actually useful in the kitchen. Clean cuts and still cuts a tomato. Crap, okay, I need to beat you in DPS to be better now. Well, I do 15 damage and attack 10 times per second, but I've also got two extremely overpowered abilities. Bruh, I can only do 90 damage at my max, but I can throw my knives, and I also get a chain. Chainsaw. That's sick, but also kind of trash. Wait a minute, why can't I just throw the chainsaw? <laughs> I want to shoot you in the head. Same here, bro. I don't want any competition. Guys, you're supposed to be meeting, not to be killing each other. Ugh, oh, fine. What do you do, you elf-looking thingy? I am the Holiday Archer, not an elf-looking thingy, and I shoot out arrows that can pierce multiple enemies, and at my last upgrade, I shoot out swords, though my accuracy isn't very good. My accuracy is very good as nothing gets past my bow. But what are those sword arrows? Well, they're my last upgrade and do a lot of damage. How much? About 27 per... Huh, that's kind of weak for a sword arrow. Why do yours do more? Well, per arrow, no, I do 25 per arrow, but I also attack four times per second, so overall it's better. Bruh, who created this dumb logic? Ninja Kiwi, of course. Ninja Kiwi, I hate you. Yo, I'm the gladiator. Oh, hello, I'm Sauda. How much damage do you do, madam? Thank God, you're nicer than Shredder. I do 150 DPS with my normal attacks and have two abilities that can also do a lot. Wow, that's cool. I can't do that much, I just do 80 DPS, but I've got an ability that increases my DPS by 30% for 15 seconds. That's cool. My abilities are one where I jump on the balloons, and the second I charge on the track three times, dealing a ton of damage to balloons. Wow, that's so cool. Ninja Kiwi, can I please e Mary? the gladiator nope you can't marry towers from other games we love rockets we love strong rockets yes bro my rockets are very strong really how much damage do they do an insane 12 dps you know that's kind of trash right wait what i do about the same dps as you but i also buff all mortars and bombs and i also have an ability that stuns balloons and also deals 12 damage bruh <laughs>
then jamming is in the house. Bro, that's such a cringe voice line. What's cringe is that you literally stole my outfit. Yeah, okay, we don't talk about that. What do you do? Well, I give cash to the player who placed me, and I can also make balloons go down a layer so I can do up to 40,000 damage in a single ability. Okay, I really don't care about damage. What I do is that I make towers get discounted by 20% and they get like 35% more range. That's kind of trash, to be honest, but I'll let you meet the village. Yo, what kind of buffs do you give? 35% more range and also 20% discount. Have you you got no speed or damage buffs? Yeah, no, I don't. Wow, that's kind of trash. I can give towers all across the map. 100% extra attack speed and 100% more pierce. And without any ability, I give 15% more attack speed. I'm done with this bull crap. Okay, let's get to the point. You do the same thing as me, but how well do you do it? Well, I give three extra damage to towers around me and it lasts 10 seconds. Wow, my ability is able to buff towers damage by 50% for seven seconds, but I also have guns and stuff, so I'm better than you. Bruh, I can slap balloons and I also have an ability that makes me squeeze any big Moab class balloon under a bad. Still worse than guns. Yo, I'm the artillery. Yo, I'm the mortar monkey. What do you do? Well, my non-upgraded one is good as it does 65 damage but costs $8,800. Wow, I cost like 600 but I do a lot less damage. What about your upgrades? As my top path, I have an ability that makes me automatically aim at the enemies and easily popping them as well as making tons of money. You're kind of like my middle path, but I don't make money. And I also don't have auto-aiming. I just have an ability that rains mortar shells from the sky, and they make balloons get stunned. Yeah, we have completely different purposes. What do you do with this path? Well, I've got very good damage for crowds of enemies as well as for single target, and I can't auto-target, but I can see camos. That's basically what I do except for the single target part. How much damage do you do? Well, I do 1,300 damage to a singular enemy, but I can hit a lot more enemies at once. I don't know how many, though. I can do 45 damage on up to 200 balloons, and I'm guessing you hit about as many balloons as me, so you're quite a bit better than me. Heck yeah, I am, but John Roblox overworks me. Hey, just come to BTD6. We don't have that dumb stuff here. Nah, man y'all are too ugly yo what's up i'm the sniper yo i'm the sniper monkey what do you do well at base i just shoot out a two damage shot mine does eight but i reload a lot slower than you what are your upgrades with my top path i shoot out a 200 damage bullet but i attack only once every three seconds and it can also pierce through multiple enemies I do 280 damage and I can also stun and make Moab class balloons a lot weaker. But I don't have the piercing thing you have, though my middle path can ricochet attacks from balloon to balloon. I'm my next path, now I don't look any different, but now instead of having 200 damage, I have 110. But I have such gigantic range that I can almost see the entire map and I can also see camo. And I have an ability that temporarily removes camo from all enemies on the map. Now I do a lot less damage, but I have incredible attack speed that lets no balloon get past. Yo, I'm the armored zombie. What's up, do you have an immunity? Nah, I've just got a massive amount of health. Oh, how much? Wow, I've only got seven, but I'm also the downfall of all noobs. Since I've got metal properties and only certain types of attacks can pop me. Wow, you seem stronger, but only in some situations, but I've got so much metal on me that I move very slowly. Ninja Kiwi doesn't believe in the laws of physics, so I move pretty quickly and I'm also floating metal. You're so stupid you don't eat brains. The creator of them is John Roblox, so they aren't very full of knowledge. Well, yes, but they're very good for getting health since I have. Oh, that's like nothing I have. Bro, what you must be weaker at some other thing. I don't know, man. What's your speed like? Well, I'm very, very, very slow. Oh, that's nothing like me. I've got the speed of a regular balloon. Which round do you spawn on? Oh, yeah, that's it. I spawn on round 13. Bro, what? We've still got yellow balloons back then. Yo, I'm the boat monkey. I'm the patrol boat. What do you do? Well, I just shoot out darts from the two sides of me. Okay, I don't know what I do at base since I couldn't find it on the wiki. Bruh. What about when you're ug prated? This top path has incredible range and does great against single target, since with it I upgrade my gun and also gain missiles that do about 300 damage per and have good multi and single target damage. I kind of do the same thing as you as I have missiles, but I have passive missiles and an ability missile which does a lot more damage, but the passive ones go on every Moab that comes into the map. How much do they do? The ability one does like 15,000, and the passive ones do 750. Bro, your other path must be trash if this one is so OP. 
I've now got a hook and ability that can hook any Moab class balloon under a bad, no matter how much health they have, and I also have overpowered bombs that go out of my cannons and do lots of damage. I thought you'd be bad, bro. I'm good mostly for crowd control, as I've got a flamethrower that can pierce through many enemies, and I only do 60 damage. L plus ratio. How can a monkey be made out of ice? I don't know, man. This is just the BTD6 logic. What's your upgraded for like, though? In this form, I shoot giant ice that strikes through Moabs and slows them down as well as does pretty good damage to them. You're exactly like this path of mine as I do a lot of damage, but I'm better at freezing higher level zombies. And how much damage do you do? Dang, that's pretty good. I can only do 50. Now I do no damage, but I can perma-freeze weaker zombies, but you need multiple of me to freeze higher tier zombies. Okay, now I've got an ability that freezes most bloons on screen, but it's only a temporary freeze. <laughs> 